Hello everybody and welcome to Yellow's Marble League. Today we're going to make a walkthrough of the game that got updated a month ago. I'm, I'm sure you already know this, but our game got updated and um, the two uh, main things to say is that we got the story mode on board and we're ready to roll. But before that, I would like to uh, get to some other features for those who are new to the game. Uh, before you, uh, before you uh, start a new season, uh, you might like to, you know, Custom Team 2. Set up your custom teams. You have custom three slots. Team three. Uh, where you can um, have the uh, the logos. Uh, you, you, you can either have an on, uh, online um, image for, for a logo or uh, are, are remotely on your desktop. You can just copy the path of the image and paste it here. Uh, you can change the, the name of the team or the abbreviation or you know, what, what's 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 the who's who's the coach of uh, of the blackjacks? Don't remember. Uh, let, let me know down, down in the comments which is the coach. Uh, anyway, so uh, from here you can choose which marble to edit. Uh, for the Noxus Ivy, two. I dragged an uh, online image from um, uh, you know for watermelon and made it transparent. Okay, these three marbles do not seem like an Oxious Ivy because I got the orientation uh, wrong, but anyway. So, without any further ado, let's start our season. As you can see on the right side of the screen, this is still early access. Although, uh, this does not mean that uh, the story mode is, uh, is not complete. We've made it and uh, it's, it's there for you. So, uh, let's start with the Blackjacks, one of my three. favorite teams in the JMR uh, universe. From here you can choose which marbles will compete against you, and uh, on the bottom uh, left of the, of the screen, you can choose uh, story mode to run with it or without. By default, it's checked, so if you, want, if, if you don't want to uh, manage your team properly and, uh, you know, have training and manage your budget or get some messages from, uh, from, from, from others and you just want the simulation, you can uncheck it. If you don't though, and <laughs> I, bet, I bet my money that uh, you, you would like to play story mode, just, just leave it checked. So, uh, I will make this quick. <laughs> Okay, we're ready, you have mail. and we already have some emails to uh, read. As you can see, I've already uh, played some seasons for testing purposes, so welcome to Season 14 of Gellas Marble League. To start uh, you off of this season, uh, we're giving each team a gift. You have a choice between an extra 500 or a Joker. Well, this is a very important decision to make. If you're not so sure that, you know, let's, let, let's describe what's, what's, what's a Joker. The Joker is a card that you play before one event of your choice and you get double points after the uh, end of the event. If you get a win, then you will get, instead of 25 points, you will get 50 points. But if you end up in last place or in 15th place, you will get 0 or 2 points. You know, it's, it's, it's a gamble. So you have to know exactly where your team's strength and weaknesses are to choose uh, the correct uh, event for, for your Joker. If uh, you know, if you're new to the game and you would like to do this through training, because you know training is very costly in this game, you can take the money, and it's it's a very good um, uh, it, it, it's it's a very good um, let's say uh, choice to to start with uh, some extra cash, especially if you don't have any spare marbles. Uh, I, I don't have any gold marbles because I've, I spent them all, but we have an initial budget of one thousand, and if I run if I run low or run out of money, then I can drag from my deposit, which uh, is uh, taken from the arcade mode, the single player and you know, this stuff. Um, I would like to, to, to choose the Joker. Yes, your team will receive double points in the event where the Joker is played. And the Joker is played only once in one season. The other 15 teams also have uh, the ability to, uh, the option to use the Joker. Uh, but, you know, this is not mandatory. You might see some teams use it or some teams not use it. Anyway, uh, we got a message from Roldo and he's be, uh, the quiz master. Uh, he will send us question from time to time which will uh, give you a prize. This is, this is a very good prize actually. Uh, 100. Which team broke the Marble League record for rafting in 2019 with 33.74? 
Okay, that's that's why the price is very high. That's a difficult question. Ah, uh, 2019. Okay, let's let's look at our options. Ocean is midnight with single light and green tax. Uh, the Ocean has had a horrendous season in uh, Marble League 19, uh, being the host. So I I rather doubt uh, setting a Marble League record in a water event that season. Midnight Wisps. They might. Team Galactic. Um, I will go with the Green Ducks. Yes! Yeah, baby. 100 extra. Which means that we can, uh, you know... <laughs> let's stop digressing. Uh, let's uh, go to the locker room. And here we have two types of training. Short course and long course training. Uh, the, the one is, you know... Neither of those is uh, available before event one, so we have to complete event one first and then be able to uh, get on training. So, uh, heart, club, diamond, spade, and ace, all these marbles have their stats. They are semi-randomized and um, they make overall an average team. So you're not a very good team that can, can win easily the championship, nor they are... Um, a very bad team to finish last so it's all up to you whether you are managing correctly your balance your financial balance the decisions and the marbles you know the marbles are getting tired uh, if, if you overuse heart for example this zero uh, this zero percent of tiredness will become will soon become 100 and heart will underperform so uh, let's start the first event which is swing wave I will skip the opening ceremony because I'm pretty sure everybody uh, have seen that or if you don't, you know, it's it's, it's a very nice uh, opening ceremony. The developers have done a very, an amazing job, not a very good job, but ama an amazing job to uh, capture the real opening ceremony from the YouTube videos. So, yeah, but we will skip it for now. And we will also skip the intro. And the Raspberry uh, Racer. So let's and get down to business. Bees. Round one. And down they go. A very, very. Ooh, that was. That's that's a joke. I mean, what's that? Best finish of five. Wow, seven for the Raspberry Racers. So sorry for them. Oh, a few struggled to get off the line cleanly that time. We have. Three marbles overshooting their target, so they won't score any points in the danger zone. And 18 for Oceanics, 11 for Team Galactic. Tension ratcheting up as the they Noxious sit Ivy in the now. blocks. And the Custom Hazers. Team two. And the Hazers. Yeah. And they're going to be off again. As you can, as you can hear, great. Oh, the Noxious Ivy. They, oh, wow. they made the Sinceroo and, wow, the Hazers, Hazy thought that they, 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 would, they would go a bit too far, but then they stopped their momentum and Hazers got a zero. Instead, Noxious Ivy scored very well, 31, this will be hard to beat. Um, anyway, I was saying, oh, yeah, uh, before I get to that. Um, yeah, so you can see the stats of each marble before you uh, start your run. So my strategy, it doesn't always work, but, you know, it's, it's reasonable, is that you don't want your marbles to overshoot the target. So you want to place the slowest marbles at the front and maybe the weakest if they are all uh, very fast. So I will put heart in front, then club, which have 64% and 67% of speed respectively. And then we will use one fast marble, uh, well, one strong marble uh, behind to uh, push them just enough to take that extra point uh, because, you know, if you have a lot of small, slow marbles, they will stop midway through. Well, they might. But anyway, and, and you want a, uh, a quick marble to uh, push them a bit as well. So, the o -Rangers. this is the recipe. And your team. Let's see if we will succeed. They well, no. That was a horrible no start of the season. That time. 15 points. It was a close match between us the and the Rangers, but and the balls nevertheless, of chaos. it's a very low score. Thankfully, we got another round, which will... Uh, uh, oh, wow, 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 wow. We got a very good 
that was a performance from performance. Uh, the Thunderbolts, 29, that's second place. The Bolts of Chaos, I thought that we would have, we would have three tens. This would be a record. I, I've, ne I've never seen three tens or four tens uh, in balancing. The but yeah, and they blew the Jawbreakers. Anyway, uh, I, I was about to say that Greg is very much present in this game right now. Uh, we kept all those audio clips that we had Great in the previous um, uh, versions of the game with, um, you know, scavenging from the audio files from, uh, from the video oh videos, which were very good, but, you know, everyone could notice that they, they, they were um, repurposed audio clips. But we had Greg, had a session, a very uh, big session, a very nice session, recording session, and he records a lot of lines. Which, Boy, I never grow tired of seeing those marbles making a great start. As you, as, as, as you can see, as you can uh, hear, Greg is very much present in this game oh, right now, and this adds a lot more there. to the game. And we also have a lot of cheering uh, sounds, a lot of chants. But yeah, I digress once again. Raspberry Nine, round nine of sixteen, raspberry racers and the bumblebees. Down they come. That's, that will be neck and neck to the bottom, and we got three. Three of them, they overshoot. Oh, that the, is probably the not what they want. Ten. Wow, three! What the score is this? 15th place for the, for, for the Raspberry Racers. The Oceanics. Wow. And Team Galactic. You know, I, I've seen a zero once, but unfortunately I didn't record that. But three, that's, that's very low. This bolts well for us, though. Um, who we need. A very good result to make up for the Once more, 15 points we got earlier. So Noxus Ivy, he didn't get, he didn't get it right that, that time. The um, instead Hazy or Smoggy, I don't know which marble is this, got that 10 and 23 points for them. Fifth place. You know something. Um, Okay, we have diamond with 90%. I, I, I will choose heart with diamond. And spade with club. Make sure that, you know something, um, if this is a bad strategy, at least we will have some marbles that goes uh, to the line and get that 10 well, if points. You struggled to get off the line clearly yes. that time. Come on, what's that? Come on. Oh, the crowd really appreciated that one. Yeah, 20 points, 6th place for now. The Thunderbolts and the Balls of Chaos. Okay, now we want to see the only sub-20 point performances and the Thunderbolts. Yes, they overshoot that. How much, how much? Balls of Chaos, they got 22. We dropped one place. If and we're rolling! Behind this, I don't remember, to be honest. Okay, we have uh, a non fin uh, we, we have a non scorer as well, from the Limers and a tally of eight points. Tension the Jawbreakers did a very good job. They're the sitting blocks, in a podium the position. Pinwheels. And, and Team Momo. Yeah, and if uh, neither the Pacific Pinwheel, Pinwheel, so Team Momo did not score big. Well, that's a very good score for the Pacific Pinwheels. But but what this will be? Fourth. Wow. So this is the lava the, rocker. This means that and the hornets. They will not be uh, cleanly away podium. that time. You see, you want to avoid smashing against each other, even if it's your teammate, or your competitor, your you know your uh, rival. You don't want to hit each other and um, mess up with your momentum because then you will score low. Twenty points for lava rockers, twenty-eight for the hornets, and we got ninth place. Not great, not terrible. But here's the closing, the, not the closing ceremony. <laughs> uh, hello, Waldo. Custom Team 2, uh, aka Noxus. Ivy got the gold medal for the, from the first event. Jawbreakers, like they did in Marble League 16, they got the second place in the first event. If I recall correctly. Anyway, so uh, we don't have any messages for now, so we can. Um, go straight to balancing well actually we can uh, go to training if we want to yeah let's 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 go to training instead of going to going to balancing this this will be uh, nice so uh, what kind of stuff do we need we need speed 
we need our marbles to be uh, quick because if they're quick we can actually um, get to the to the finish line and balancing uh, easily before we uh, you know uh, decline from our uh, straight forward path and fall off the side of the of the cut uh, track so I will choose the long horse training the long horse training is sand muggles actually with a lot of items we have uh, speed items uh, endurance items strength items health items motivation items and uh, resting items so rest restness tiredness yeah we have rest items uh, so the more you get the better your stats improve but there are also some bombs if you remember from the arcade mode these uh, courses have bombs and if you um, step on them you will lose everything so we have to be cautious and another thing to tell you is that the more money you have on your account the more uh, bombs will uh, will appear so yeah be careful be careful minions so um, we want to improve speed and tiredness so we will uh, search for the speed yeah this, this is speed and disease oh no we missed the Z well my screen is a bit laggy it's, it's not my computer it's, it, no it's it's so easy to get distracted especially if you're narrating the the event and um, you know everything will come undone you step on these uh, these bombs, you know, I, I can't even narrate and I can't uh, focus on which which items to get because they want. Oh no! Wow! Sorry if I scream to your face, to your ears. Uh, I, I really apologize for that, but you know, it's pretty intense. It might seem uh, easy, but it's not. Anyway, that's round one of three. We have three rounds in the long course train, so you can choose three marbles. 75% yeah it's, it's not worth oh we still have 22% of retirement anyway uh, we don't need to spoil club we need other marbles to get in the top of their uh, game as well so hard we search for speed uh, and tiredness yeah same Tiredness. We we need disease. Yeah. Oh no. I missed that. And I missed the other one. You have to look. No. You have to use both your peripheral vision to avoid the bombs. And also look far ahead to search the items you want to hit. Yeah, that was close. And you know, uh, because I had to change my path in order to avoid all these bombs, I overshoot and. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, we lost a lot of them. Only two. Oh no, two each. Oh. Yeah, very disappointed. I, 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 I will try again with heart. Eh. Come on. Focus. Focus on the game. On the speed and the resting item. This one resting item. Maybe, maybe moving your camera um, way behind, you know, far away. Your uh, flyover follow camera. Oof. I miss the Z's. I miss a lot of Z's. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Yeah. Conservative. Three uh, Z's and eight speed. Uh, boosters, which means 16% of uh, speed tokens and um, tiredness is reduced by 6% which means we now got 8% this didn't oop okay yeah so uh, this display gives you all the stats as they uh, progress uh, during the season and if you right click uh, no left click on the uh, graph then you will get individual uh, graphs for speed, endurance, strength, motivation, health, and rest and uh, tiredness. So uh, I think this is it. Maybe, yeah. 
uh, tune in with us next time. Uh, I will upload videos regularly, so the whole season will be uploaded with uh, well, you know one or two events depending on the uh, screen uh, screen time. And um, yeah, if you reach this point of the video, it means that you liked it. So make sure to show to the others that you liked it by pressing that like button and subscribe to Minus Marble Orchestra if you want to see more of that stuff in the future. Hello everybody and welcome to the second episode of um, Yellow Marble League Season 14. Uh, we're now running the updated game of Yellow Marble League with the story mode. So um, I will not keep you waiting. Let's let's go to um, event number two, balancing. Uh, as, as you can see, we can either opt to use the Joker for this event or not. I will choose not to because I'm not very convinced that we can uh, score big in this uh, event. So let's be conservative. We don't want to throw in our cards early in the season because then we will uh, left uh, empty-handed. So round one of 16, and Raspberry Rumble. Racers. Yes. No finishes. 332. You see, in real life, this score, 332, is pretty go good in, uh, the YouTube, uh, in the YouTube videos, in the real life, let's say, uh, Marble League. But in the game, uh, a score of 315 or, you know, anything below 350 well, never grow tired is of not that good. Making a great start. I guess there will be a few tough conversations for some of the teams back in the locker well, room. Well, the Oceanics, they get 309. This is not good at all. Team Galactic. And off they go. Well, oh, this is even worse. What's, what's wrong what with them? They Did they have a party or something? Did they overslept or lose their sleep? And they're gonna be the Noxious Ivy. Again. They live strong, they lose one, two, three, and what they got to the finisher. That's 424 points. This is a serious contender for a podium. Uh, they got first place provisionally, but by come. the end of the event... Oh, the Hazers. That was... that was paltry. From the very beginning, uh, 337. Now the Rangers, round seven and of sixteen. Again, teams definitely could have been more organized there. Yeah, three hundred seventy-four. They're provisionally in second place with one finisher, and it's our turn at last. Um, well, what's what's the recipe of success for this event? Honestly, I don't know, but. I uh, believe that if you separate somehow the marbles from each other, then they will, uh, it, you know, it's 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 more it's more possible, more likely that they will follow a straight path down to the uh, to the end of the catwalk uh, course. So they will not fall aside. Hopefully, we'll see. Uh, let's see the the stats. Spade has 17 speed. Diamond has 100, and um, you know the the principle is that. Who's in front? This, the fastest marble. Well, not that one, but diamond. Next. Um, now that we have the... Uh, 81%. 75. So 75 somewhere, yeah. And the 70. We don't want the 75 because they will be equally quick. Uh, well, their potential will be uh, equally quick. And uh, we don't want that. So, every everyone is 75? Gosh, no 70. Anyway, in that case, we have to abide. Let's make sure, yeah. Go! Round 8 of 16. Boy, I never grow tired of seeing those well, we lost too early, one start. in the middle, and we got one finish. Sure. This is not round that time. very good. 3-3-5. Three, three, yeah. I'm not convinced that we can reach the the, the, the top ten now uh, by the end. And you know, we time. really need those points. The Thunderbolts got a decent performance, 377. And you know, I've played through a lot of seasons of, of uh, Yellow Marble League. I've seen a lot of 400 plus scores. This time around, the teams have lower scores, which is you know, it's normal, but it's also weird. They go. Given the amount of points that we got, we seriously Not need too uh, some poor performances from our rivals in order to, you know, make up for our performance. We already lost three places, and uh, we dropped down to seventh. And we also two points behind 
uh, the Hayes is in three points ahead of the Raspberry Racers. I mean, it's so close. The whole field is so close. It's competitive. And we're one, 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 um, you know, if you step one, uh, one foot wrong, things can get ugly quickly. 379, the job breakers provincially on podium positions. Down they come. And but this reminds me of all the Pacific Pingles. Oh, the crowd so really difficult. appreciated that one. I absolutely adore these models. I wish we had some of these in real life. It's my, by far, my favorite fantasy team. Rolling. And as you can see from the selection, I also love the, the Lava Rockers. More organized there. Anyway, I digress. Momo, still that third place from the Jawbreakers and uh, sits in the podium for now. The Lava Rockers. They got oh, the crowd one really finisher, appreciated that one. which means 350 and 8th place. We drop down to 11th. And with one marble to go. The Hornets. Oh, they didn't score big. I think they will be below us. Yeah, 15th place. Wow, okay. That's that's a 303 score. Uh, the Noxious Ivy, they get... Well, gold medal. Where's Roldo? Where's Roldo? Hello, Roldo. Now let's take a look at the and now standings. two out of two. The Noxious Ivy get 50 points. They get the absolute maximum. Well, not the absolute maximum. If they want the absolute maximum, they should use that Joker. But you know something? Uh, even if it's a huge... Um, you know, it's a huge advantage to, you, to, 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 to use your, um, your Joker when you win. Even if you don't, well, 25 points is a, is a huge, huge lead. Jobber gets them in second place with 32 and the Thunderbolts with 26. We get one message from the message you center. You have mail. Uh, from the coach, club has been feeling pretty tired lately. We have an opportunity to send them for a course of relaxation treatments, whereby their general health should improve over the next course of... Uh, over the course of the uh, next three or four events. Okay, so, if we gave... 100 now uh, Club will gradually uh, Feel better and better which is something that we need instead of spending a lot of money uh, In training and trying to find the tiredness items. I think this is safer And you know if I run low on cash or you know run out of money, I can always uh, Convert my my uh, the, the marbles I got from the arcade mode and the single player mode to increase my uh, tally, my you know my financial balance, uh, but this has a um, you know it has a budget cap. You cannot get twenty thousand uh, fr from your marbles. I mean, if you have so many marbles, you could, but there is a budget cap that limits you to two thousand of uh, uh, you know of this marble currency. Anyway, next up is a five minute sprint. Hmm. The 5 meter sprint is a very interesting uh, event. So, heading over to the locker room, I would like to see the standings. Ooh, okay. Uh, not the standings, I, I, I meant the graphic with the stats. Let's see which um, marble is the fastest one. So, we got uh, Diamond, 100% of speed, 58 endurance, 89 strength, 92 motivation, 76 health, and 16 of tiredness. It's a very solid marble for 5 minutes sprint. I will choose Diamond for the uh, next event and I feel pretty strong that we will get... Uh, I feel pretty positive that we will get a strong result. So, start event with the Joker. So, I'm skipping the intros. We're not so uh, interesting for this. And down toward the finish line. This is Hate 1. Raspberry Racers. And it will be yeah, a they close match. Uh, were by far last. Now remember, but we it's got, the first a very, very interesting fight progress. for the front. Unfortunately, uh, I, I was I was focusing on the Raspberry Racers and missed that we uh, that you know the the top three was decided by 13 milliseconds. Anyway, oh, this is so early for us. Uh, I didn't uh, expect to be in in uh, the second hit. So Diamond, 100% of speed. Let's see whether they spot well for us. Great start. Well, we got an initial sound that was pretty average, if no, not bad, but we managed to make there. up for it. And this is where the, the, the stats kick in. I mean, 
you know, you, you, you can use a marble with 100% uh, of everything. But the reality is that it's not a given that you will Down get through. this first place. Um, it's, it's, this 100% is 100% one, really of your potential. So, if uh, my marble is weaker than yours, or, you know, slower than yours, and you get a 75% uh, of speed, and I have 100% of speed, does it mean that I will be faster than you? It means that it's more likely that I will uh, use my 100% of my potential, but this doesn't mean that I will be faster. Then again, uh, it's, it's, it's an assist, yeah, for sure. Not a great start from everyone. That, that's, that that's why that's why we've got training to uh, ever so slightly help the users. Oh, surely that's a get, thing. Get into all of the game. And now remember, it's the ooh, first wow, 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 each wow. round. The win progress. was decided by one millisecond. I want to watch them on the watch replay. On the replay. Pacific Pinwheels. Wow. I, let's let's get a top-down view. Whoops. 50. Whoa, that was so close. Anyway, next up, it's our turn. The semi-final A with, its, with Team Galactic, Bumblebee and the Noxious Ivy. I really hope that Noxious Ivy will be kicked out of the event. No, they will progress on to the Get final and then with us. Uh, and your team, team Galactic advances to the final. Yes, we do advance to the final, but our main rivals, Noxious Ivy, advance as well. The balls of chaos. The so we have to work the hard if we don't want to get a gold medal. Imagine the next is having three are. out of three. Wow. Anyway, semi-final 2B, uh, so semi-final B and the balls of chaos obliterated the competition. Is this the fastest time we get from, like, everything? Anyway, we get um, the bottom 15, or let's say the rest of the marbles that didn't progress to the final. Um, what did they say? Bottom 15? Sorry, bottom 12, I should say. And now we get on to the final. We will use Diamond again against Noxious Ivy. Team two, oh, yeah. The Balls of Chaos and the Lava Rockers. Thank you, Greg. Let's see and what they can do. Down we go. Oh, it's, it's dead hit. But we got the upper hand. And this is a gold medal. And yes! And the Noxious Savvy got fourth and they place. On for the gold. Yes, baby. And it was the best performance that we got um, in the whole of the event. 6.913. So we won in style. Whoa, okay, this is re relieving. All our, um, you know. Movements did not go in vain. And hello, Rodza on the comfy chair. As we take a look oh, at the current the love chair. Always good That's, to get that you know, first podium under the your belt. Love chair. What's the point if you're all alone? You should get your partner. And Rodza has a whole entourage. Anyway, we got tied with uh, the blackjacks, but because we have uh, one gold medal compared to two gold medals with the Noxious Ivy, we sit in second place. Nonetheless, we got 10 points and uh, 10 uh, places up in the standings. Wow, awesome stuff. Let's go to the message center. You have mail. I'm so excited. Oh, that's a quiz. Which team won the first event of Marble League 19? Oh, get out of here. Get out of here. Ah. Uh, Marble League 2019. Green Ducks, uh, well, who won? <sighs> Solar Flares, no, Solar Flares didn't, com didn't even compete, they weren't even present, so they're not them. Um, Mellow Yellow, they could, because they're a strong team, and, um, you know, I I'm leaning towards Mellow Yellow. Brosper Racers, they won the previous Marble League, you know, very, uh, fashion style. Well, no, they, they, they didn't actually. Midnight Wisps won the previous Marble League, Marble League 18. So, uh, Green Ducks, it was the, the, the first event of their career, so I rather doubt they won uh, a gold medal. Uh, I think they were on the podium in the, for, in the first um, event, but it's 
between raspberry racers and mellow yellow. Mellow yellow. No, it was the green ducks. Oh my, the green ducks got a gold medal in the first ever event. Wow. Okay. Spade has recently developed a fear of heights, and the transparent green funnels certainly don't help their anxiety. Spade has requested that they uh, stay on the bench for this event. Well, ah, uh, that's that's a serious matter. I will leave that to you. Uh, let me know down in the comments uh, whether you uh, whether I should um, keep Spade uh, out of the next event. Hello everybody, welcome to the third episode of Yellow's Marble League Season 14. I'm your host, Minos, and um, today uh, we will be continuing on with uh, the next event, which is no other than the Final Endurance, a Marble League classic. But before we uh, go there, we should check in our locker room which which team is, uh, which, which marble is the best to choose out of those. Um, 37% endurance. You know, Fallen Endurance, as the name says, it's an endurance bound event. So we want to use one model that has, uh, ha you know, a lot of endurance and maybe a lot of strength. So it's between club and spade. Okay, let's start the event. Hello, everybody, and welcome. I'm Greg Woods. The Funnel Endurance Event. The marble that stays in the funnels the longest will win. And so you see the first flight of orange funnels first. Standard size before you drop into those larger that require a totally different strategy. <laughs> I, I love the, all those other types on, the, on the same version of the game. So, uh, we will skip the example run. It's a very lengthy one. Oh, it's our turn in the first group. So, um, well, 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 well. Club, yeah. Fingers crossed we will progress the final. And down toward the finish line. I would like to change the camera. And get, yeah, that, that feels better. And we can pace against the Nacho Saibu, which fall in the seventh place at the moment. We're in sixth now, we're in fifth. So neither of us is progressing to the next round, but we desperately needs to get more points than the Notre Savi if we want to continue our quest for glory and fight for the championship. So far we're just one place ahead of them. I mean, okay, we did the job, but we need to progress the to the next round. Hypnotic at times. Yeah, go one for three. Yes, 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 yes. Oh no. Oh no. We lost speed. We lost speed. It will be close between us. Team Galactic. They're out. The Noxious Ivy. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! The, the Noxious Ivy got a point from behind. Is the winner. Oh no! And we lost. The blame, is it the team? Gosh! Or is it the management? No! No! Come on! Not, so, not only we were eliminated from round one, but Noxious Ivy Boy, got to the next Steve round. Marbles making a great start. Remember, you're trying to stay in the longest. That battle up top is the one you really want to watch. These circular motions are almost hypnotic at times. I'm speechless. I, I, I cannot even concentrate to, for this round, so... Ten. I thought we were strong enough with 82%, but you see, this is this is what I always say. It's not a given. If you choose your strongest marble, your uh, you know, with, with the perfect stats, it's not a given that you will uh, compete to the top level. Other marbles may be sad, uh, better than you, you know, slightly a teensy weensy, uh, better, faster, stronger, or you know, more durable. Anyway, we get to the final. As Oops. they enter, we oh, already see two drop jittery. into the second, and three now into the third funnel. Yeah, this camera doesn't help at all. 
in the Noxious Ivy. Oh gosh, they're in third place. Not only they progress to the final, but <laughs> they are they're serious contenders for a podium as it stands. Are they now in first place? Yes, they are. Well, these circular motions are almost hypnotic at times. Come on. Fall through. Fall through. Hit someone. Do something. <laughs> Come on. Alright, I guess this is it. Oh, actually they got a poke. Last but, marble to but finish still going to be a podium. The yeah, for sure. Second place. Well, we got five points less. But they still three podiums out of four events. Wow. The Noxious Ivy. As we take a look at the current standings. Well, they are... We see lots of changes of position. They didn't lose any places, round. thankfully, the because overall standings we scored... Look a bit like this. Uh, pretty, pretty, you know... I, I don't want to say well, because I, I expected so much more, but, you know, it's... It's, it's not terrible. I, I, I have to be uh, realistic, it's not terrible. But we got uh, 13 points behind the Pacific Pinwheels, we got a podium, so damage limitation at least. And the Jawbreakers. Uh, Noxus Ivy, they sit uh, 15 uh, points. 15? Yeah. 15 points ahead of us. Okay, so you have mail. Message. The management and team owners would like to send a quick message to say that to say well done and keep uh, keep it up. We're very happy that the current performance. Gosh, I, I, we're happy with the current performance of the team. Top three is great. Let's keep this going. Yeah, but I want first place. I know that I get. I I can get first place. Really? Haha. <laughs> okay, so really. Um, it is a teamwork um, event. We need to get a lot of things right. Thankfully, the other teams have to do this as well, so uh, if we do one minor mistake, this won't be the end of us all uh, compared to the Final Endurance, which, which saw us, uh, you know, all the time in the back of the field. So, um, let's see the, 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 the stats. We want speed. We want motivation. Oh, and we need money. Okay, I have to get from uh, my account some more cash. I don't want to overdo it because uh, maybe later on we will need some money. So, um, one, one advice from uh, someone who <laughs> Um, have fallen for it in the past. Do not get all the money at once. Do not get to the budget cap at once because uh, then uh, if, if, if you will be asked to get some money uh, you will have to pay for those. But if you run low on cash you won't have to, uh, you know, you can say that we don't have the budget for this. But if you have the budget for this you will be always tempted to uh, buy some new equipment or get a spa session or a special training or something you know all these all these stories that trigger from uh, from time to time they all cost money and um, the budget is not so big as it's uh, as it seems maybe maybe we see it in a healthy 1000 at the moment but anyway i digress let's go to long course training uh wait we haven't seen short course training so far and i need to show this to you um, my team is not very well. Thankfully, there are some highlights. Yeah, let's go, let's go to short course training. Short course training is a five meter sprint uh, mode without the lanes, as you can see. Uh, and you, what you all have to do is to go down the slope, and by sitting with the uh, uh, W A S C, well A and D for left and right buttons or the left and right arrow keys uh, whatever it suits you best 
Um, you can steer the marble left or right to get all those points. Uh, I usually set my camera up, uh, you know, far, far, far behind the marble and up so I can see uh, how the items are distributed or how the tokens. And here is where we need to change the marbles. We will get one run for each of the set, which means uh, six runs. One for speed, one for endurance, one for strength, one for motivation, one for health, and one for tiredness or restness, as I say. Uh, club has very poor speed and we need to improve speed whatsoever. So, one light, two lights, three lights, and we roll. Yes, yes, we have to be precise. Oh no, we missed that one! We missed one! This will mean that we'll get 18% instead of 30. No! No! Alright, next up. Endurance, 77%, 70, uh, 97%, 76, 50, 90, and 50. One of, one of, one of these two needs to get to um, at least 80. Well, 80 is the best we can. So, Diamond has... Yeah, Diamond is, is, is the answer. Um, I also sometimes, you know, steer the marble right from the get-go to the left side of the uh, track to slow me down and me... Damn! It didn't work. So, the principle is that you get uh, the... <sighs> you get the speed... Uh, slow, uh, you get slower in speed, so you will be able to, you know, um, move across the track from side to side, up and down like a roller coaster. No, uh, side to side, and uh, get uh, as much items as you can. So, 9 out of 10, we should get that. Uh, 10 out of 10. Who's next? Ace. 71 versus 91, 189. I would like to go with Ace this time. Two lights, three lights, and we go out. Well, they go out. Yeah, that was impossible. You know, sometimes the distribution of the, of the tokens, of the items, is impossible to get 100%, uh, not 100%, but to get uh, 10 out of 10. So, who's lacking motivation out there? 78%, 61, 94, 88, and 59. Uh, Spade, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? You see, it's it's very hard. Maybe 8 out of 10 is possible for this run. No, no, no. no. Oh, okay. 9. 9. Why not? We only missed one. You see, they were from one side to the other side. It's almost impossible to steer. And steering is not the same as in arcade mode. It's a bit, a bit rough around the edges. Well, do we have edge edges? No, because we're around. We're marbles. But you get the point. Uh, sometimes um, steering is not sometimes, but the steering is not as smooth as in the uh, in the arcade mode or single player mode. Well, single player you cannot steal the marbles, but anyway, here we go. Forty percent. What's that? I really don't want to use that one. So uh, I will improve heart, um, collecting some hearts. Pun intended. And we go to the side. One and two and three and four and five and five and six, seven and eight. Sixteen percent. Anyway, uh, who's tired? Speak up now. Two percent, zero percent, twelve percent. Are we going to use this marble? No. So we don't want to, uh, uh, you know, help this marble. Hard. Uh, is one of the marbles that will be used, unfortunately, uh, even though it's one of the weakest of the roster that will be used in Relay, so we want them at least to be uh, well rested. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, this will do. Seven. Yeah, we got that to zero. And that's it. That's, that's the short course training. And we're ready to roll for event five. Of Marble X21 Relay. Wow, we see three teams uh, using their jokers, the Limers, the Arrangers, and, and the Oceanics. Of speed together, 
So if we want to keep relay. our um, I'm great championship fight alive, we <laughs> we need at least uh, some of them, if not all of them, Rock to uh, you know drop down the order. We don't want them to score B, and of course we don't want them to score any podium. Not too shabby. The Oceanics got to the next round, so <laughs> yeah, I guess. Anyway. All right, all right. So, um, well, the course is the same as the five-meter sprint, but you always stop because you have short, um, uh, short stints, uh, four short stints. So, Diamond will go first to get that initial uh, advantage that we need, and then uh, nice motivation, eighty-eight percent, and then we need. Hype innovation for the next one, so club will say there, even if it's on the 58. Do we have speed? Uh, 78%, yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, I will go with that one. So, motivation uh, is 79%. We need the, the, the hands out to be the hands over to be quick, and then we need two fast marbles. That's not fast, hard 75, and eight will be. Replaced by club. Okay, the the final the final stand will be very slow for us. We need anything anything that we take that we gain will be in the beginning and we didn't. The oh, it's neck and neck with uh, the Rangers and we got a very good hands out to the third scene. Now the fourth scene. Oh, it will be close. We got it. Been more organized there. And we got it. Team advances to the next yes. Round. We advance to the next round. I'm so happy. Great start. And the Rangers didn't, which is very good as well because they are using their Joker. The Linus are what? The first. A win, right. and by some distance. Where are the Raspberry Racers fans Waiting to throw some, the some uh, stuff on the, the Pacific <laughs> on this one of the cause? Team Momo, the Lava Rockers, and the Hornets. And they're off. Oh, it's, it's pretty close for all four of them, but we've got the separation. No, we actually got the Pacific Penguins and the Lava Rockers head to head. It's be really tight at the and line. it's going to be first place for the uh, Pacific Penguins, second place for the Lava Rockers, only 14 milliseconds progress. behind. Ah, uh, yeah. Same team. It will be close, and the competition will be harder. So maybe we need to change hard with club. As our last scene when, uh, needs to be needs to be um, faster. We are rolling away. Again, we lost out, and we're sitting in third place. Oh no, fourth place. Oh no, it's it's going down. It's going down. Coming across the line. Eleven uh, thirty-six. There will be some fifty-seven. Eleven fifty-seven. Back in the locker room for not they say is the time to, to mark. The next round. So we need the other semi-finalists uh, to be slower than that. The Limers, Balls of Chaos, and Pacific Penguins, and the Lava Rockers. The Limers will advance. And the line. I hope they were slower than us. 57 1. Yes! We got two points. We got two places more. So, that much limitation, we got 10 points. Well, it, it was never going to work. I was really hoping for that, um, for that final, but you know, in the end, we got a 56% uh, in speed. Across the line, uh, they one go. of our uh, athletes, which made it impossible to make up the speed. The, the most unfortunate thing is that we had one marble with 100% of speed, and never capitalized that. Maybe I I, I I put them in the wrong position. Maybe I should put them uh, in the very last scene or in the fastest speed, which was the third, I think. This is where we gained the most time in the uh, previous round. Anyway, the Oceanics and the Limers, they used their joggers and they got a top one too. Congratulations to the winners. This bodes as we take ill for us as standings. it will be very hard work. Wow, look at that standings. 85 points for Noxious Ivy, 77 for us. We kept our positions and we only got only one podium. This hurts. 
But then we got Limers uh, with 75, only two points behind us, and the Oceanics with 69. Okay, the Oceanics are eight points behind us. It's it's a fair uh, amount of points behind, but wow! I mean, the Bumblebees. What are we doing back there? 19 points and Team Galactic only one. Oh, actually Team Galactic got from last place to uh, uh, P15. Anyway, uh, we keep the dream alive. You have mail, and we have five neon reds. When was the Hazes' first appearance in Marble League? Okay, that's an easy one. 2018. We're writing to all teams to inform that their party allocation has increased in price for this season. All teams must pay an extra 100 to maintain their parking spaces here at the stadium. Okay, I guess, you know, I, I, can, I can ignore it, but, you know, thankfully I'm healthy on cash, so I will pay this now. You see, if, if you ignore this message, uh, after the next event... Oh, we, had, we have a spicy story here. According to the rumor meal, uh, Hart is having an affair with Vivid from the Valiant Valley, Violets. I'm raising my concerns for you. Oh, it's a coach. Okay. Uh, my concerns that, your, that our captain may get distracted by this. After all, Vivid has form and a bit of a reputation. Leave it, uh, it's a personal matter and we cannot get in the way of love. You're right, Vivid's relationship with Baldi with Baldi. Ah, with Baldi was the cause for the green green gang. <laughs> That's nice. To go from here to zero in the Hobolino tournament. I will tell how to put an end uh, to put to put an end it to it, yeah. Now. Anyway. Uh, what should I do? Should I leave it or should I you know get some boundaries there? Ah, you, you know, I I'm the romantic guy. I I will leave it. Yeah. After an equipment audit, it appears someone has been over-polishing the jousting ball bearings. Tampering with official equipment and try to gain an, an advantage is strictly forbidden. If any teams have any information about this, please get in touch. I have no idea. Sir, we don't know anything about this. Yep, that's the truth. Hart thinks they saw someone from the, the Oceanics in the, in the equipment room after the relay. They can't be sure exactly who it was though. Many apologize, apologies. Uh, club said they were inside polishing all the ball bearing after the last training session, but only to keep them clean. They didn't realize this was against the rules. Okay, so I guess this uh, story is a matter of uh, morality. You can either, uh, you know, keep it neutral, I don't know anything, I say nothing, uh, or uh, blame someone else, or take the blame by yourself. Thing is, you choose your path. Um, do we like to be the good guy and take the blame, or do we like, do, do we want to be the bad guy and uh, I, I don't know what the, what the answer is, but I'm sure this has to play something with the stats. Maybe motivation runs uh, runs slow if ah uh, uh, if uh, you know if if we blame someone else, maybe uh, heart will. Uh, will drop in performance or if uh, we say that we did it then we get some more motivation that we you know we were honest and stuff I don't know I, I, I seriously don't know what to do you know I will take the blame I would like to see what this means for the game because of this we're going to overlook the matter for this occasion please make sure it doesn't happen oh shoot I risk getting a penalty for that. Thankfully, the GMA said that I was honest and, you know, I didn't do this. Well, club didn't do this for, to get an advantage, but just to make, you know, the ball bearing clean. So, yeah, it won't happen again. Sorry about that. Congratulations on your recent management decisions. They're clearly uh, paying off. Whilst the season isn't over, we're delighted to be maintaining the top three spot. Uh, the team is highly motivated because of this. Thank you. Alright everybody, welcome to Yellow's Marble League. I'm your host, Minas from uh, Minas Marble Orchestra, and today uh, we're going to continue what we left um, in the previous video. This is season 14 of uh, Marble League 2022, uh, 2021, and um, today we're going to go to jousting. But before that, let's go to the locker room. 
As you, as, you, as you already know from the previous videos, we have these uh, wonderful statistics of all the marbles, how they progress um, uh, during the season. And uh, I mean, jousting is an event of strength. You want to be both uh, strong and a bit of, uh, you know, fast in order to, to reach the ball bearing first and, um, 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 and push it all the way to the other uh, side of the terrain, so of the arena. Uh, so, uh, looking at the stats, I see that, you know, Spade is <laughs> a hot gun on the, for, for, for this event, so 100 of strength and 93% speed. Now, the other marble, because you know, jousting is a duo event, the other marble that we need needs to be also needs, uh, also needs to be uh, strong, but this time we want to be slow in order to give that extra push after all the marbles have fallen uh, uh, to push the, uh, the ball bearing. So, what do we have here? Hmm, club. Club is a very nice candidate. And um, eight? Not so good. So, spade in front and club behind. This will be a recipe for potential success. So, uh, skipping the, the intro and the example run, we already know what this come. event looks like. And we have the bumblebees who had. Oh! Yeah, this, this is a very nice feature that does not exist in, uh, in uh, real life Marble League. Uh, you see, the score is 7.7 .7 because uh, the game counts where the, the ball bearing falls. And I think this is where we got it wrong in real life, JMR, uh, in real life Marble League because we counted uh, the distance that the ball bearing, the ball bearing covered uh, right uh, at, the, uh, at the moment where the, the ball bearing was leaving the arena. So uh, if, if the ball bearing falls on, uh, on, a in a, on a competitor, this won't count for the extra push. And but the game the has line. this little thing for, you know, uh, suspense. Maybe the, the ball bearing uh, off can slide slowly marbles. on your terrain and then fall on another marble and go to the Custom other side. Team two. And, and completely the changes the, uh, the score. I feel this is this is very interesting. And for once we got the the team on the on the right side winning. And this time is the Hazers. So club, as we told, as we said, uh, okay, we will replace uh, hard with uh, spade and club with spade. So, uh, where are we? Yeah. Um, so, um, as we initially said, sp spade needs to be fast and strong to reach the ball bearing first in order to push it as much as uh, the marble can. And then another strong marble behind will come a bit slower, a, a bit slower and give us extra push so we can win this hit with the Rangers. The Rangers are one of What's the main more? rivals. Training us, yeah, yeah. It worked. Yes. It wasn't in vain. And this 14.6 will give um, a very hard time. <laughs> you know, it will be a very hard time for the Rangers because it will fall back now in the standings, come. maybe in the la in last place. As we saw the other hit so far, that they are uh, decided uh, within the. Uh, you know, 7.7, I think it's, it was the second largest uh, margin. So, hit 6, the Limers and um, the Guiding Glaciers. Ball bearing slowly takes its time to... Not too shabby. Yeah. Oh, it was the Job Breakers. Of course it was the Job the Breakers. The Guiding Glaciers do not even compete in Marble League. Sorry about that. So, the Pacific Pinwheels and the Green Ducks. Pacific Pinwheels seem to be in the back foot, and yeah, they will lose that hit. 9.6, still the Rangers yeah, are in last place. And what's wrong with me? I'm, I'm uh, saying all the wrong teams. It was Team Momo, not the Green Ducks. Again, the Green Ducks <laughs> do not compete in this season. Distance. Anyway, the Nova Rockers lose uh, from the Hornets. So the Rangers that got uh, a very good result with a Joker in the pre in the previous uh, events, they will be finishing in last place, getting zero points. It's very good for us, and we're competing against the Hazers. 
Okay, this will be uh, another now difficult match for us, but I, but I, but I have. Oops, it's going to be interesting. Oh, well, training days are yeah. clearly I paying off for these marbles. Let's, let's watch on, let's on the watch replay. On the replay. You see, in real life, marble league, we would count the distance covered by the ball bearing right here, right at the moment the ball bearing leaves the arena. But the game counts that extra um, time the ball bearing takes to uh, finish its journey towards the sand. So this means that the scoring system is a bit dif uh, different. So, uh, yeah. Nothing changes. Let's go. We are rolling away. Yes. You see that extra push from the second marble. Training days we need clearly that. paying off. And 9.9. This will put this will put uh, the Hazers in a very difficult position. Even if they, they go progress again. from the first round to the second round, and the bolts of uh, the, sorry, uh, Team Momo. Not the furthest distance we've seen today, today, but we What's wrong have with me, guys? What's wrong with me? I'm a blind or something? Not a great it's like I don't even know time. what kinds of teams are competing against me. But this, but this is not true. So, Team Momo wins by 9.3 uh, against the Hornets. And, yeah. The, the Hazers will finish in uh, the bottom eight. Last place of the bottom eight. The top eight, I should say. So, next up, it's us again. Club and Spade. Let me check something. Wow, motivation is also very, very high. Semi final A is underway. And time. oh, maybe, maybe we can capitalize from that. Yes! You see? What a turnaround! I won't watch that on the replay. Let's watch on the replay. We had that that little separation. If if if, if, if you watch closely, both us and the Oceanics had that uh, separation between the marbles. I'm going to put this in one tenth of the time. We we, but we had this this um, you know, this was a mistake. Even if my first marble reached the ball bearing first in order to give that uh, initial strong push against the other side, my second marble was a tad faster than the second uh, than the uh, second marble of the other team, which means that we didn't have the last say on the uh, on that um, occasion. Although, okay, the flyover camera is a bit tricky to control, but yeah, here we are. Although, you see, my rival teams are standing on the sand pretty close. Oh, I need this to be, yeah. Right there. It still would have been close. It would have been 0 0.5 in real life Marble League. Maybe we, we could, uh, you know, we wouldn't progress to the final anyway. But because, but because the ball bearing fell on the Completing marble, it lands on the sand in their terrain, which means Attention we are on the final. Sit in the blocks. Now, semi final the will be balls of chaos. chaos and Team Momo. And Team Momo. Yes, Gloria just and said they're gonna that. Be off again. Oof, we almost have the same thing, clearly paying off but we're going to the final with Team against Team Momo 3.4. But first, Tension ratcheting up as they sit match. in the blocks. The Oceanics and the Balls of Chaos. Once more, they're off. Very interesting, but it was only 1.4. You see, the two teams were uh, pretty equal in their um, strength. Your team and Team Momo. This is the final. As they launch this is the final. Yes, the we got it. Gold medal, baby. Gold medal, 7.7. .7. And that's a win in style. The Blackjacks on, on uh, the top step of the podium. Hello there, Rondo. Wow. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now let's take a look at the current standings. We're 10 points. And the podiums uh, just keep coming. Yeah, we are 10 points clear of Noxious Ivy, the, the most 
the, the most, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's a favorite for the championship. They got uh, three uh, gold medals in the fourth, uh, in, in the first four events, but since then, you know, they, they, they had some mediocre uh, performances. Oh, okay, we have you have mail. Messages. Oh, it's a quiz question. Which team took two silver medals in the first events of Marble 18? Um, all right, all right, all right, all right. Marble League 18 was won by the Raspberry Racers. I highly doubt that the Pinkies managed to took two silver medals in the first two events. You see, I, I, I don't remember the answer. Uh, even if I watched Marble League 18 uh, quite recently. Jungle Jumpers. Nah. The Hazers. The Hazers could be. I will vote for the Hazers. Well, no, 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 no. I will vote for the champions. No! <laughs> it was the Hazers. Okay. Diamond has spoken with me after the... Who, who are you? Oh, the coach. Uh, after the last training session. They've been feeling pretty good about their recent training runs and they have been focusing on their, on their hard lane. They have asked if they can be selected during today's event. Yeah, of course. Why not? Uh-huh. Our team needs a better polish of service, as our current providers are simply not doing a good job. Polishing needs, uh, polishing helps uh, keep our athletes uh, fresh and injury free. As they say, a round marble is a healthy marble. So, uh, we have three options. Let's change our polishing service. Yeah, this, this, one, this won't uh, change the budget because uh, we're changing to another polishing uh, service. Let's stick with these guys, but increase our polishing package to the premium option. Uh, it's it's pretty, you know. I don't really have the budget right now. Yeah, it's it's cheap. Let's let's have it. Club is struggling for speed right now. As it happens, we have an opportunity to send the entire team to a speed retreat. Hmm, do we need that? Uh, maybe I'll pass on this. Yeah, because. The next event is hurdles, and we only need one marble, so I guess we have one marble that's fast enough. I hope I didn't make a mistake. Let's go to the... 3, 81, 91, 33 and 58. Diamond. 0% tiredness, 100% motivation. Uh, endurance is a bit low, which might bode ill for us, but you know, I have faith. Yeah, I have a diamond. So, um, wow, this the Oceanics, they got some good amount of points, and they are stand and they are sitting in third place of the uh, upper standings. Hit one, cleanly away that time. And across the, the line is a. Uh, Marble League classic event uh, first featured first time featured in uh, Marble League 16 where we saw an epic an absolutely uh, fanatic um, custom team with, two uh, the Hazers, top three, the, the Rangers Bulls. and your team yeah uh, I, I was in different teams at the same time okay, so the Thunderbolts the uh, Savage Peters and, and Mellow Yellow with the Savage Peters taking the championship. And across the line. We won, but just by, you know, a small and margin, two, six milliseconds against to the next Anoxy round. Side. And um, they go to the second and round down they with come. us. Next hit. Oh, we have a very good bubble with the Balls of Chaos and they and get on top. The line. Against the Limers. Tension ratcheting up as they the sit pinwheels, in the blocks. Momo, Lava Rockers, the Pacific and Pinwheels, Hornets. Team Momo, the Lava Rockers, and the Hornets. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't and say the, the uh, I shouldn't do the team uh, callouts because Craig is uh, almost always saying these things. Wow, what a separation between the top two. A win no surprises and by that time. some distance. Now remember, it's the first two from each round that will progress. Yes, remember. All right. Tata. 
I know. Um, since this board is good for us, let's use the same marble. Oh, oh, we have a very poor start, but the initial. Uh, not the initial, but the, but the first hurdle was very good, and, and we the, the final. First place. And your team advances to the final. The jawbreakers. Rusty races had the a very chaos. good. They, they had the, the best Hornets launch and the from the first rockers. hurdle, even if they had Here a, they go a again. Even poorer stars compared to us. Coming across the line. I feel that like this round is a bit slow. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I was wrong. Noxious Ivy and the Oceanics uh, were even slower compared to uh, the Lava Rockets and the Job Rockets, but only by a, a small margin. You see, it was only 30 milliseconds between them. Diamond against the Raspberry Racers, the Hornets, and Cleanly the Bolt of Chaos. Time. We have three dark marbles here. And yeah, this is not going well for us, but really no, I can't I can't complain one. too much. Fourth place is I very am good. Absolutely speechless. And you don't get that very often. What on Marble Earth is happening to your team? Well, Greg, it's it's not very bad. Thank you for uh, sympathizing with <laughs> uh, losing a podium on the very last uh, you know, on the very last page after look after getting wins and both. Standing occasions Your team but you know we get some good amount of event, points and we increase our lead from Noxious Ivy we're sitting in the first place with 13 points lead uh, 17 points clear from the Baltic Bears who got the fourth medal wow all right you have mail. all right we have mail insurance premiums have increased significantly this year we must pay an extra 500 yeah I don't have a choice. Cheers. So Greg would suggest to get an interview with Spade. What shall we tell him? All right. Uh, Greg. <laughs> Greg is a very very nice figure. I. Um, I would love to have an interview with uh, Spade. So. Uh, we would love to get an interview with Greg. I repeat myself, and. I only wonder, if. The, his last comment about us, uh, you know, he was saying uh, what on Marvel was happening to our team after finishing fourth in the final round. I wonder whether this interview would be good for uh, Spade. Let's 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 go over to Spade. The locker room. Uh, Spade. Motivation runs high with the uh, and good health. A little bit tired, but. Recovering from that, good endurance, they lack speed. The next event is not speed bound, it's uh, block pushing. So, I guess you have made Greg will not have um, a malicious <laughs> intention towards uh, space. So, yeah, let's get an interview. Hart is down on endurance. We have an opportunity to send them on speed treatment course. Uh, why would you do that? Or by their speed would improve over the, over the course of the three or four events. Unless this is a training in Le Mans or, you know, uh, Savage Reader's uh, facilities, uh, which I, I, I had a doubt this would be the case. I don't think that this will help. Do we need endurance? Funnel, uh, not funnel, for uh, block pushing? I don't think so. So I will pass on that. That should improve their speed. Okay, th there's there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of problems with my team. Uh, let's invite the Sand Rally professional to give our athletes extra tips and training advice. Okay, we have uh, the option not to do this, and we have four options to invite Lollipop, Super Bowl, uh, Cool Moody, and Red Number Three. I will invite Cool Moody. Cool Moody is a, is a legend. Not that the others are not. But Kulmudi is no, cool, kinda. Hello, Marble Fellas. Welcome to Yellow's Marble League Season 14. Today, we're going to continue our quest for the Marble League Championship. Uh, we left uh, just before block pushing. 
And I want to check my marbles whether we need some kind of training. 58, 85, 79. You see, we have some um, problems with strength. My marbles are weak and they are tired. This is a, a turning point in the uh, in the season. If we look at the standings, we are just before uh, the you know the the first half of the season. So, uh, maybe we have to increase our budget only by a tad. Well, <laughs> seventeen hundred is not a on just a tad, but you know. All right, so here we are in the long course training in the sand dunes of Falinia. Uh, we have to choose our marbles wisely because we will use four marbles, but we have three runs, which means that uh, we we can only improve the performance of three of them. So I guess club will not be running a training session. I mean, this marble is fast, has good endurance, great motivation and good health and has only 5% of tiredness. Um, who's next? Maybe, maybe we would like, we, we, we don't want to, to, to take big risks. So one of these three marbles, um, spade, ace and diamond will sit on the bench for the next uh, event. And I feel that this will be ace. So, let's start with Diamond. We need strength and tiredness. So, we need to find the Z's bubbles and the ways. Okay, three, four, five. Yeah, a bit of the other stuff. Oh no, I miss it. I miss it. I need to get my camera. Yeah. The closer you are to the... Eh, almost got it. Ooh, oh, 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 that was close. Uh, my apologies for not narrating what I'm doing right now, but I, I, as you seen from the, my previous runs, you know it's it's a bit difficult for me to narrate and, and uh, concentrate to the uh, to the training. I would rather less, um, you know, let, let the music play and you know not fall into uh, any bombs, malicious bombs that will, you know, that will mean the end of me. So, uh, tiredness was uh, decreased from 15%, I think, to 7 uh, Not great, not terrible. Next up is Spade. Spade needs a bit of strength. Hello, Rodo. And some Zs. Let's find some rest. Okay, first, second. And we also need strength. No, I missed that. No, 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 no. Why would I do that? Why would I risk it? Ah! Come on. No, not again. Not again. What's wrong with me? Okay, okay, okay. Let's, let's focus. Let's focus. Don't let this distract me. Okay. Okay, strength is 100%, but tiredness is 7. I would wish for that 0%. Anyway, heart is next. 5%. So we need 3 Zs, and how many? How many? We need 35% of increase. Okay, this, this will be difficult. We will not get 100% from this. Uh, run, but this is make or break. Let's go. All right, we're fine with the Z's. Let's let's go only for the green stuff. <sighs> Jesus. Oh, I lost both of them. I missed both of them. Okay, I, th I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, ho, 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 ho. let's go to the other side. Yes! Come on, one more. 14. 14. How much is this? Yes, 100% of strength and 0% of tiredness. Yes. 
Oh wow, look at that graph. Look at that graph. Heart. You are the marble, I guess, not the man. Um yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Let's go over to uh, block pushing. Hello, fellow marbles. Invisible blossom. And by Z and BZ, how is this is pronounced? I've said this before. <laughs> I absolutely love these fantasy sponsors. Coins, clueless cactus. This is one of my favorites. So, um, what, what, what's the deal with uh, with block pushing? Four teams compete really against each other one. and against all of them. And their goal is to push that block as far as they can. They have four uh, tries and they start uh, every time from a different position. So you, you see Bumblebee starting from lane one. In the next round, they will start from line four. And, and then from line three. Because they started from line two. The same applies for the other teams. And um, you see now that we made three hits, the 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 that's the best you know, uh, the best two count to the um, to the results, the final results. So if your team is not performing uh, at all times, that's that's no biggie. You just have to have two glory runs and hope for the best. So. 95%, 100%, 71%, and 100%. Um, club? Yes, yes. Club will be changed with heart. So we will swap these two marbles. So we need, you know, the, uh, the weaker Custom of the four the uh, the at the back. And your team. So first... Yes, yes, yes. Go, 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 go. 60-ish. 63-something. 0-5. Not a good one. Uh, let's make sure that... Uh, I will change diamond with heart. Let's see if this makes any difference. We side by side with Noxious Ivy. Yes, yes, yes. This, this, this looks good. 75! 76, maybe? 75, 78. Yes, one more of these, and we are ah, the bosses. We'll be serious contenders for the podium, actually. Yes, that's another good push. Wow, 74 high, 70, 74, 20. Okay, that was 74 low, but anyway, you get, you get it. I think we found the correct recipe. You first put your strong marbles uh, at the front, and uh, behind them, you just put the weaker ones because maybe there is. Wow, we're we're sitting in first place, one forty nine ninety seven. I doubt that anyone can beat this. The limers and the jawbreakers. This is a hell of a score. Down they come through, and boy, look at the speed that they all have. Okay, okay, everyone had to. A very good run. The Thunderbolts, 75. Um, in order to keep that first position, we need them to have 74 and or below. Woo -hoo -hoo, 80! 80! 80, 96! What? What, what's, what's going on here? Job breakers. Slow out of the gate to start. Okay, that's nice. Oh, that is probably not what they wanted. Oh, this is this is what I wanted. So, yeah. Boy, I never grow tired of seeing those marbles making a great start. Oh no. Okay, uh, I think we're safe. Too shabby at all. No, 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 no. The jawbreakers. They are they. Waiting. At they the they surpass line. our the uh, tally. Pinwheel. Only, only by a margin, though. The rockers and the hornets. And well, I cannot complain too much because we're still in second place. But we need these marbles to settle down a bit and that time. Uh, secure that podium position. And we are for this one. But this is the thing with uh, block pushing. This format 
Uh, it's not, you know, uh, the, the results are not dependent from the first two runs. You, you, you can have two horrible runs. And if you do great in the next go. two, then yeah, that's that's nice. Okay. Team Gal uh, not Team Galactic, uh, but the Pacific this Pinwheels. 70 point uh, uh, 43. They are sitting at uh, 138.57. That's that's a good result, but they if, if they want the to get line. on the podium, they need 75 plus, and they won't get it. No, 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 they, no, no, nobody's going to get it. So this is it, second place. Wow, and the Thunderbolts they got uh, uh, the next the third step of the podium. Okay. Just keep coming. I think we're safe now. But do not get uncomfortable because <laughs> the second half of the season will be a hammer to us. Everything, uh, you know, everyone will uh, will, have mail? will throw everything on us to to, to beat us. So uh, the JMA administration, after several complaints from Brothers whereabouts were, was being constantly shown in the Jumbotron, IT have discovered that the Jumbotron has been hacked. Whilst no serious harm was done, IT are unable to explain how this has happened. Um, some can see the funny side, but Roldo is most displeased, and some are pointing the finger at one of the Roldo's entourage. Why would they care about this? But anyway, it's a fun story nonetheless. We just received a special offer from Marvel Pro Energy Gels. If we buy in bulk, we only pay 50%. You know something? No, uh, I don't care. I don't care. We need to save money from now on. I don't mind saying that we could get used to this. More time, <laughs> more time uh, 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 in the number one spot feels amazing. Let's not get comp complacent now and make sure we continue to be focused. It's ours to lose now. Awesome job so far. The coach is very pleased with the management and of course the athletes. Uh, next up is triathlon. Triathlon. I will. I I I feel that the local heat, you the know we we're races, going to the bumblebees, the oceanics, to bow team over the the great teams Off here because we do not have any uh, assistances. We didn't get any, um, you know, some extras or any training. So I guess we have to use our less tired marble, regardless of the other stats. Because triathlon, in triathlon you need very good overall health for this water section, for the underwater section. Oh, this will be close! Who got it? Zero! Point zero zero four! Wow! Oh, it's it's our turn. Okay, so we have to... Oh, 31% of clubs are tired. 34% for diamond and spade 41. You know, uh, Ace, I know 52% of speed is not good. And endurance, endurance is good, but strength, we need, we need strength to muscle our way up to the uh, race. But, uh, you know, health is also low. Th th this will be a miserable run for us, I I'm sure. I will change to this camera. Oh, if you struggled to get off the line cleanly that time. Uh-huh. We're in first place, surprisingly. In some section section we can see Okay, okay, this is this is the big thing. This is the big thing. We are in first place! Wow! Excellent job. Ace! You are the ace, the real ace, not just the card. That was surprisingly good. I have to say, great start. I, I, I was thinking that we would be fourth and by some distance. But we advance and, we'll, and we will be in the top eight, regardless of the, make a big splash here. Of the next uh, results. But yeah, so far I'm, I'm very pleased with the result. Even if we finish in eighth place, ace is not in fine form so remember it's the first two from each round that will progress yes we know 
the Pacific Pinwheels, Team Momo, the Lava Rockers, and the Hornets. Down they come. You see those uh, those sand curves and the attenuator in the middle, well, not that many attenuated, but the split is uh, shocking up the order because otherwise you would have uh, the the team that starts from la uh, lane one would always have the advantage from being um, in the inside from uh, of turn one. The Lava Rockers are winning in style and Team Momo almost, and I mean almost, got it. But the Hornets advance to the semifinals. Ace, yes, yes, please, Ace. Can you please do a miracle? Yes, first place again. But we have to be cautious because the Hillsers are trailing back. The other two have a big separation at the back. Okay, okay, we are we are losing first place. No, we got it back. Yes, that's it. We're in the final. The underdog is at the final. There will be some strong words back in the locker room. Oh, not making it. Oh no. Oh no. The job race. <laughs> the balls of chaos. Okay, uh, I'm just with the Raspberry Racers. I thought that we were winning, you see. <laughs> I was daydreaming. <laughs> Okay, okay, as, as, as I said, we progressed to the next round, so uh, being so slow, we, uh, we were uh, 4 point something seconds off the pace, so uh, we, we'll still get 7 points, I, I, I'm not mad, I'm actually very pleased to see, oh, may, maybe, maybe we can jump up to 7th place, no, 8th place, okay, not bad, uh, we took 8 points, the raspberry that's that's good that's the that's hazards. actually very good uh, concerning that ace is slow, slow out of the gate to uh stop. doesn't have any endurance maybe, maybe the endurance was the the make or break factor anyway anyway we are in the final Looking to make a big and the lava rockers are are breathing down the neck of oh no they actually they, they're actually losing second place right now Oh, this will be close on the line! Teams definitely could have been but the Lava Rockers held second place, Jobbreakers got third, and the Gold Wendell is for the Raspberry Racers, which, <laughs> in the same final save, <laughs> you know, uh, this model from the Raspberry Racers is so dark, I was, um, you know, I, I was confused, and I thought it was uh, Ace. Anyway. Congratulations to the Raspberry Racers. Now let's take a look at the current standings. And Your team a yeah, even though Balls of Tears and Noxious Hybrid did not get a huge right amount of points, the Job Rays and the Raspberry Racers are now with you know Raspberry Racers with two. Uh, I think they got two medals, two medals in a row. They are you know th there's there's five teams uh, very close to us. So, one would prefer to have one team trailing them, uh, you know, a couple of points behind, rather having five teams in 35, uh, not 35, uh, 20, yeah, 25 to 30 points behind, because it's still very early in the championship. We may have this, this huge mar margin. I mean, how many points is that? This is 29. It's 29 points. Twenty-nine points clear of uh, second place, but this come undone easily. You see my marbles are going uh are getting tired. It's 27%, and this is the and this is the good news. Uh, we will also run out of money soon, so we have to do our best in the first half of the season and then hope that we can, uh, you know, that we can, uh, you know, make ends meet and finish, uh, I don't know, top step of, of, uh, of the podium. Can, can we win the championship? I don't, I don't know. 
I don't know. We, we need to be lucky. So far, it's looking good, but I'm very, very conservative about, uh, about this. Anyway, so I think this is it for this uh, for this video. Thank you so much for joining me as well. Uh, and if you reach that part of the video, it means that you liked it. So smash that like button. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Yellow's Marble League. This is Minas, your host. And we're left right after the first event of the second uh, part of the season. We're sitting uh, in first place with a healthy lead uh, after, you know, we are, y you see the standings right now. We had a mediocre start of the season, but we've got, uh, you know, a gold medal with the Joker, which means that we got 50 points instead of 25. And then we've got two podiums as well, while our main rivals lost their momentum. Noxious Ivy, you see in the first four events, they were untouchable. Even if we had used our Joker, we were, we were uh, still behind them after winning uh, two, the first two events and got the second place in the four, fourth event. And you see, even the third event, they got 12 points. They didn't score bad. But after that, everything collapsed. Although, as you see, any team in the top five, except, except uh, from us, of course, they have not used their Joker yet, which means that our lead can evaporate within uh, within within one event. Anyway, let's go to the message center and see what comes for us. Who has been the captain for the Hazers of the Hazers since 2019? Oh gosh, I'm so bad at this. Um, Foggy, hazy, smoggy, misty. Misty? No. Foggy? No. It's it's between hazy and smoggy. Who's the captain? Ah. Oh. Jeez. Write me down in the comments. I will wait for you. I, I will not answer yet. R write down in the comments which is the captain of the hazy since 2019. Um, I can safely say that Marble One Season Three had uh, Hazy and Smoggy racing, and I know one of two are the uh, is, is a captain. One, one of the two is a captain. So um, Hazy, yes, forty bucks in our buck. Uh, well, well, well. What do we have here? <laughs> That's nice. All right, so uh, next event is Stable Chase. Stable Chase is a team event, and um, I can't do much to improve the to improve the team. You see, Stable Chase counts the time. Of the first three marbles that finish, uh, the fourth one doesn't count. And uh, let's let, let's see the event. Uh, every stick that you drop from the course means one penalty point for you. So the faster team, you see, you see, you dislodge those sticks over the steeple. That does get you a penalty. Uh, um, I try to, to say this, but you know, Greg is the master, and he always say these things uh, very good. So three penalty points so far from for the Raspberry races and a very poor performance overall, twenty-two point five. Even if uh, this is only the first round, uh, not the first round, but the first team to compete, I assure you, this is a very bad result. That's three penalty points for the Bumblebees as well, but you look twenty point fifty four. This is two seconds. Or two points, if you wish, um, better than the Raspberry Racers, even if they had three penalty points. Two penalty points so, so far for the Oceanics, and I think this is it. Ooh, 20.52. That was a close one, but still they got first place. Next up, Team Galactic. One penalty point so far, two, and maybe three. No, it's, it's two. 19.65. 
you see the potential is very high if you keep away from these um, from the six and you not <laughs> drop everything like <laughs> the noxious ivy what a poor performance 22 point uh 46 this team is seriously dropping down the order and with Great this start. result they will not get uh too many points i think i'm almost certain that they will lose second place from this event but i digress view rangers round seven of 16. they drop one and they drop two you see since since the team sees who are the top three the fourth novel doesn't have the motivation to run and get tired so they sit back they do not uh, tumble with uh, the other models uh, you know destroying their potential not their potential but their momentum and keeping away from the uh, stakes the rangers got a very good strategy so we will follow that i think that heart is uh, you know the marble on the graphic that run uh, that uh, is on the right side will be on the left side but i'm not sure whether this is line one or line four so this is that's a bet i want to keep the most hard marble away from this event so maybe spade 99 percent of strength wow that's that's very good we want spade to be rested and club will step in instead yeah anyway let's go i have very low expectations from the for this event we drop one we drop two we drop three and 20.68 we are below average we're in the bottom four and with half the marbles to go i expected 12th place would be a realistic but good result I don't think I've seen a more prepared and i'm seeing 0.96 and if they hadn't dislodged this last sake this would have been an easy win for them uh bolts of chaos uh-huh that's a six that is a great result 19.71 that's what was indeed a very good result now the limers As they the, the limers need to, to keep up their form if they want to hope for big results in marble right, 2021 the and they did it 18.89 first place provisionally Once the job breakers a very strong team they dislodge one sick now two and three no surprises that time 21.49 that's not good at all the pacific pinwheels here they go again here they start they dislodge the first and the second and the third oh no this is going this is going horrendous for them 22.5 12th place to momo now and we're rolling they dislodge three and that's at 20.67 the field is very close you know you see if, if you score 20 something well not 20 something but 20 point something uh it might be even from uh, fifth place to i don't know 12th place 15th place for the lava rockers that was a very poor result four penalty points 23.53 and the hornets the last marble to compete they dislodged three out of three no but that's it that 21.3 10th place we sit in ninth place seven points that's good for us and i think no one used the joker let's watch the podium the balls of chaos and the lime uh, the balls of chaos team galactic and the limers The Limers got. Um, is this the first gold medal? Yes, it is. 124 points. Uh, they sit 25 points behind us. The Balls of Chaos. They are trailing right behind in second place. Noxious Ivy lost two places, and this is the good, the good news, because you see, 
The Oceanics are also tied with 116 points, but because they have only one gold medal, they sit in fifth place. Uh, the Jawbreakers are uh, very, very close behind, and the Raspberry Racers as well, even though the Raspberry Racers lost three places. Anyway, let's go to the message center. Mail. Diamond has poor endurance. Huh. No, no shit. Unfortunately, there are no special treatments of course, uh, or courses available right now. Okay. Yeah, we don't have the money to. Oh no. Ace is complaining that they feel extremely, uh, that they feel extremely weak right now. We have a few options available for us. Send Ace to a uh, one-to-one -one strength session with former world's strongest marvel, Marbles for Marbleton. Let's really take advantage of this opportunity and send the whole team for a one-to-one -one session with former world champions uh, strongest marble the same one and we don't really have the budget right now how much do we have should we do this what's the next event the next event is sun muggles sun muggles is only for one marble so you have mail no i'll pass on that i'll pass on that this is a very good opportunity. You know, if, if it was about uh, resting my marbles, I would say yes. But for strength, nah. Woof. Ah, okay. I see the potential here. So club. Club will compete in sand models. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Past winners of this event, Midnight Wisps in 2018. Well, um, we're in the first of the two hits. Um, yes, Club is going to fill the shoes of Ace this time. I mean, it's very tired. This marble is very tired, but we can't do much. I would rather have one. Oh no, I missed the. I missed Waldo. I was about to press that button, but then the race started. Anyway. We're sitting in fourth now, second place. We often see I'd like to change to the other. The yes. Part of the course. Uh, and, and a nice feature of this game, now that uh, we're on Sound Muggles, uh, you see the tower on the left side of your screen. If you tap on one marble, in, uh, you can see their, their POV camera. And we're sitting in sixth place. We're not progressing. But but it's, it's, still, it's still close. No, it's not close. We have finished in seventh place. Well, I am speechless, and you don't get that very often. But what on marble earth is happening to your team? Well, Greg, um, sorry to tell you that, but we are very tired. Now they count. All right. Th this was expected, to be honest. But the thing is, what our main rivals will do? The Pacific Penguins. Let's let's like let's follow the Pacific Penguins really that are standing in eighth place right now. Do they have the strength? Do they have the momentum or the energy to progress to the next round? So far, no. The Lava Rockers are enjoying first place uh, finish. Oh, that was... Really appreciated that wow, that was almost... You see, Limers, 0 0.98, and then the Thunderbolts were tied with the Pacific Pain Wheels. I thought the Pacific Pills would do would do it, but they didn't progress to the next round. Hello, Roldo. No, no, not, not again. We missed Roldo again for the for maybe a tenth of a second. Let's change camera. I don't like this. We often see overtaking chances in the sandier part of the course. Yeah, maybe the whole course is sand. Uh, which one should we follow? Limers. Limers is a very good option. Or the Raspberry Racers, who stand second in the standings. I feel that the Raspberry Racers do not have the energy to move up uh, the order. They're sitting in seventh place now, sixth, fifth, and fourth. Wow! They saved the energy for the last part of the course. That was very clever from them. The Oceanics got the, th the third place. Silver medal in second place for the Lava Rockers and Team Galactic. They are continuing to um, impress, taking the top step of the podium. 
Where's Roldo? Oh, yeah, Roldo was at the course. As we, take a look at the current we sit in first place still, but you see the balls of chaos. Ah. And, so, and it's not only them. 132 points for the Limers. The Limers are silent, silent predators. Sorry about this sound, but yeah, they're silent predators. The Oceanics, 131 points. This championship is getting hot. Wow, the Bulls of Case have yet to use their um, the Joker. The Limers and the Oceanics did that, and they were pretty clever to choose a very strong event for them. I mean, it's very natural. The Raspberry Racers, though, they haven't used that. And having two wins, one second place. I think they're, they're, they are saving energy to strike hard in an event that they can and, and will capitalize from the use of the Joker. Uh, I think that we will leave this video as it is for now. And uh, if you want to join us in the next video, if this will be in two days' time, consider subscribing if you haven't already, so you could be notified, so, you know, tap that bell as well. Alright, hello everyone, this is Minas, your host for Gilles Marble League, the game season 14, and we're going to round 12, diving. First, um, well, I have, I have two mails, but I will ignore them for now. I will go straight up to the action whatever action diving has i mean it's one of the most boring Your events i mean in real life at least oh wow Obviously the yellow pupils is a big part of it. maybe you can you could consider replacing the whole team of uh, uh crazy cat size not a great start from everyone that, time. that was a very nice performance way better than the raspberry racers but 9.7 is the mark to beat Bumblebees. Looking to make a big splash. Bumblebees do not score big. 7.84. No one is using their Joker this round as well. Oh, that's that's a bullseye. Yes, they got a one, and the Oceanics got first place. In a water event. That's nice from the Oceanics. Well done. Team Galactic. One. One, one, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's funny. One, two, and two threes. Uh, 8.84, they sit thirds provisionally. Run five of 16, Noxious Eye. What they've got. No surprises that time. Indeed, Reg, no surprises that time. Uh, the Hazers, now they're diving, and that's good. No, it's not good. 7.67, they sit in, in fifth place, and with uh, two thirds of the uh, line up on the field to whoa 10.82 and good synchronicity as well but it's only good for second place now let's think about it let's think of it uh diving what do you need to dive and get a big score you need maybe uh good health High motivation. Oof, don't know. Well, uh, fortunately, my marbles got, got some rest, so club will sit on the sidelines for now. Spade will step in, and and uh, hopefully we can get some good results. We need to keep not the to dream alive. Not too shabby. Yeah, not too shabby. Uh, fourth place, 8.84. Cleanly away that time. We're for sure outside of the podium places, it's and now we're sitting in fifth place. In fifth place, uh, the Thunderbolts got a better result. Now the balls of chaos. We don't want them to score B, and they will. Seventh place. No, they didn't. They are behind us. Two places behind us. That's good news. Now the Limers. Oh, horrendous. Scoring round that time. Perfect synchronicity. They were spot on, but they missed on the landing. I feel this is this is a break even you need to make. You, you or, or let's say you have to concede for something. Um, well, that's that's nine 
that's nine that's good performance from the from the uh, job breakers uh, you see you either have to look on the bottom and not on your side because if if you if you're synchronized then it means that you have an eye contact with your uh, fellow competitor right beside you but then you might lose on the landing and this is exactly what happened to the limers they were extremely oh zero minus 0 0.01 that's very good actually for team moment and as you see even though they were synchronized they got very low scores two ones one three and one zero one zero not a great start from lava rockers 12.92 whoa whoa all right all right and the hornets Oh, I think that's that's a zero. Oh, it's 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 one. Okay, so the Lava Rockers stole first place from the Oceanics right at the end, and saving the best for last. And where's Roldo? Roldo is at the VIP section again. Lava Rockers, where are you? You gained two places oh gosh oh god you see our huge lead has evaporated we're sitting only eight points ahead of the oceanics who just got second place from the vault of tails and third place uh, and uh, sorry and uh, limers dropped from third place to fourth but everyone is right behind us bumblebees having a horrendous season i'm sure they don't want to you have mail it's a season to forget some team members are running alone in endurance we can send them to the 24-hour le marble facility uh at felis or Veliz for a really long training day i'll do that we need we need endurance so Ace is losing strength due to a poor diet. We have a few options available for us. Ace, uh, send Ace to special treatment facility to improve their dietary habits and gain strength over time. Or we have a deal with a new protein pr uh, powder. Shall we give it a try? No, thank you. Leave it. Uh, we're already spoken to Ace uh, about their diet. They will work it out. Yeah, I'm sure about that. Ace feels relaxed. But what, what, what's wrong with Ace? What's wrong with you? Dude, get your stuff together. Shoot. Speed. Um, no. No. The next, next, uh, the, the, ne the, the very next event is elimination race. So we need one marble with high endurance. And um, that's it. So how does that down on speed? No. Again, that's a no. We need to save money. We might need to get some training right before the... You see, we have an elimination race, uh, sand rally, football, and marble cross. Uh, no, 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 no. We, we, we need to save some stuff for uh, sand marble rally. You see, our performance have, has dropped. It's not a given that uh, if you are getting some training, you will be continuously performing good, but Let's go to the next event. One of my favorites, I should say. Oh, why did they press the home button? Anyway. All right, this is it. Elimination race. Yeah, of course. I will skip the intro. I'll... Sorry about that. I will skip the intro. I will skip the example round and find which race it will be. Okay. I guess spade. This is your day. I will lose camera. You see? This is the favorite cam this is my favorite, favorite camera for an elimination race, especially if you are Wow That was <laughs> one of the most easy wins I've ever seen from my team All right, spade again Let's be sure that yeah During the event tiredness is not increasing so do not be afraid on using the same model again and again and again of course, um, after the, the end of the event, if you run multiple uh, 
heats or races, especially in elimination race, um, your marble will be seriously tired. But if you split this to different marbles, you will get two or three or even four marbles tired. And this is something you don't want to see. So I prefer to keep my other marbles rested and, off they go. Uh, and watch from their huge TV screen the performance from uh, Not too our star. Okay, we survived that one. So we move on to the next round. Our main rivals are still in. Alright, Spade. Away, that one. Oh no. No, 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 no. Get ahead. Get ahead. Yes. Yes. Get them. Get them. Get the Limers. Alright. That's that's very nice moves. That is Towards terrible. the finish line and we survived once again. The Thunderbolts, they are out. But the Jawbreakers, the Limers, the Lava Rockers and the Raspberry Racers are still in the game. Which means... Uh, we need... We need to outscore them. We need to get them eliminated before us. We can't change their fate. I mean, it's it's pretty random. Oh! The, the Lava Rockers! They are out! Bye-bye. That's a very nice start. We didn't hit too much... Uh, obstacles in the course so far, so we're sitting in the, at the middle of the field. Alright. Team Momo, they are out. This is so far they can go. Only so far. Elimination race is an exhausting event. And to be honest, I've, I've, I've played a lot of hours. I've played this game a lot of seasons. And I haven't found the, you know, the, the recipe for success. If, if, even if you save all your money and your training for this event, uh, maybe you, you can do it. But the reality is I haven't found which of the main stats are the, the most prominent. Oh, that was a very nice start. I'm really, really relaxed now <laughs> that we will survive this, this hit. So uh, I was saying that I haven't found whether it's strength or endurance or motivation or health or tiredness or uh, speed, the main factor that, um, you know, you will succeed or not in this event. There's also a huge amount of randomness in this event. Let's be honest. There's only so much... Uh, obstacles in the course but the other competitors even if you have a very good start they can hit you again and again and again and eventually you can um, you know left behind which means even if you are fast and you have you're strong and you have a good endurance if you're unlucky you're unlucky you will not progress to the next round and this is very close for us oh no 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 we got eliminated and the raspberry racers and the jawbreakers they are still in so like sun moguls as you see if you press on any competitor you can see the point of view camera from them so limers i press on limers so we will see the limers they were lucky they were sitting last at the back of the pack of the pack and they are uh, still in the game so raspberry racers an easy win no one no one in sight and the job breakers they are out at last that's the top four Leanly who is go oh the raspberry racers got you see they got an, an initial start but they lost all their lead I'm gonna cross the line. because some little marble uh, per se, the Limers, uh, were lucky not to hit any of the obstacles. But the Bumblebees do not get a podium. Not a great start from everyone that time. Maybe, maybe this performance will, um, you know, they, 
that will help them move fo forward and go up in the standings, get away from the last place, which is at least uh, shameful for so, such a strong uh, team. But truth is, this is the final Pacific Pinwheels, a very strong team, and the Raspberry Racers. I think I. I I do not make the calculations to be honest, but I think that the Raspberry Racers are in first place in the standings right now. 25 points for them. Thankfully, no Joker. So, two Fruit Circuit stars, the Limers and the Raspberry Racers, are on the podium. Oh! Well, what do you know? It was the Oceanics that got a very poor performance. Uh, poorer than us. And we still keep this that first place. We outscored the Oceanics, and the Limers are 148 points behind. They still no, they use their, um, they have used their uh, Joker. So, 13 points ahead. I think this is possible. We can win this. We can seriously win this. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Minas Mobile Orchestra. I'm your host, Minas, and today we're going to compete in events 13 and four, uh, 14 and 15 excuse me now it's sun rally and we're sitting at the top of the standings with um, a relatively healthy lead if we find the perfect marble to compete and i think this is club for uh sun rally i think we can safely say that we are serious contenders for the championship club the whole team is dependent on you. Follow camera for this event. Um, team Galactic are using their Joker. They're not competing in this. Oh, they are competing in this round and they are sitting in first place so far. Apologies for that. Uh, and um, this, this feature I was uh, saying in... Uh, Elimination race and sun models so on the left really of your screen. If you tap on any of the marbles of the tower, you will see their point of view. Wow, that's that's a very healthy lead from Team Galactic. I feel that this Joker will not be wasted. Raspberry Races in second place, Oceanics in third, Orangers in fourth, Noxus Ivy, the fallen giant from the first half of the season, in fifth place, Hazel sixth. Seventh, Bumblebees, who are having a very hard season so far. And in eighth place, it's us. And this is where we finish. In last oh, place. 1-5-14. Let's see how many marbles will, um, uh, will be slower than us. 1-5. One, 1 minute 5 seconds. And on the next, uh, on, on, on the second group, we have Bolts of Chaos, the Limers, the Pacific Pinwheels, the Jawbreakers, the Hornets, Thunderbolts, Momo, Team Momo, and the Lava Rockers. So far, the Limers, who are serious contenders to the championship as well, are sitting in third place, and the Pacific Pinwheels are also advancing as it stands. We're stuck with uh, Momo or Thunderbolts. Oh, Lava Rockers are very, very well behind. Here's a nice battle. Top three. The Limers, Bolts of Chaos, and Joe Breakers. And now, uh, the Pacific Pingles are joining the fight. Who is going to win? I mean, you don't have to win this. You just have to progress to the next round. So, maybe the Marbles should save some energy if they want to... Um, yeah. Oh, the Hornets! The Hornets advance out of the very last minute. And that's a 1-5-2-7-5. We're not sitting in last place. And that's the final. And they're going to be off again. It's going to be the gold medalist of the Sand Rally. One of the most popular, one of the most beloved events of the JMR universe. It's, it's been some time since we last saw a competitive race from Marble Rally. Uh, in uh, Gilles Marvel runs. Team Galactic. 
Team Galactic are sitting in first place and they are having the Joker. They're so using the Joker, so this will mean a lot of points for them. If the Hornets do not spot their party, they're breathing down their neck in second place. Now that uh, Team Galactic are getting some breathing space, but the Hornets are constantly right there to capitalize from any mistake Team Galactic will make. Meanwhile, the Oceanics fall from third place to fifth, but they're close with a fight on the Rangers and they pass from the outside. And, across the line. and the Galactic, Team Galactic, okay, we missed, we missed their finishing uh, moment, but they got first place, 50 points for them. Hornets took second place, Limers third, Oceanics fourth, fifth for the Rangers, sixth for uh, the Raspberries, seventh for the Balls of Chaos and eight for the Jawbreakers. Um, Rodzo will not be in, in this uh, confiture or the VIP section because um, he was in the Sand Rally section. As we take a look at the current standings, isn't this hard? Lots of changes of position after that round. As the no changes. Now look a bit like this. Well, well, no changes in, in the standings. Top five remains top five. But look at that. We're sitting first with 169 points, Raspberry Races 165, as well as the Oceanics and the Limers with 163 points. This is a crazy season, a crazy season. I'm ignoring my messages for too long and I'm sure that um, we'll get the messages for that, but you know, I, I don't want to see the messages, I want to play. This is a nail-biting end for the season. The beautiful game, yes. Um, Raspberry Races and the Bumblebees. And, we are for this one. and right from the beginning, we get a serious uh, match. But I think that, yeah, this will be 2 nil for the Raspberry Racers. They got an early lead in the first half of this match. And we're rolling. And the Bumblebees, they dislodge a lot of... Um, they dislodge four football balls, but the goalie strong. did their job. And that's the 3 0 final result. The Raspberry Races progress to the next round. Now, Oceanics and Team Galactic, one of two, will not move on. And this is good for us. What's the score? Let's go from the Team Galactic. 1 1. Okay, so it's, it's like uh, nothing happened in the first half because they are tied. And we have one goal each, I think. So this will be extra time? No. We have a late, a late goal from the Oceanics, which I didn't saw. And the goalie also uh, caught one marble. Custom Even though two. their and previous the uh, gold medal from rolling. Team Galactic come undone. Even though they got, uh, they've got, they got that um, joker of 50 points. That was a solid performance from the Sand Rally. Although uh, they couldn't move on to the next round. The Hazers and the Noxious Ivy. No goals from the first half. One goal for the Hazers and one goal for the Noxious Ivy. Late goal! No! The referee says it's over right before the final marble was going to the net. This would be almost certain. Oh no, the Noxious Ivy looked more like watermelons rather than Noxious Ivy. Anyway, the extra time. And late goal from the Noxious Ivy. This time they got it. 3-1. They progress to the next round. Okay, uh, what should we do here? Should we turn the marbles? Should we change the marbles? I think that we should save... Uh, what's the next? Next up is Marble Cross. So I need the fastest marble to be out of this event. 17, 62, 72, 75. And... Um, spade, 50, 76. Wow. Okay, so... Regardless. <laughs> okay, I, 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 I will keep them as they are. So I seriously have no clue what what kind of stuff someone can do to uh, score big in football, in Yellow Marble League football, and we are at the back foot. 2 nil at the first half. The Rangers have the upper hand. Okay, you know, I would make some blind uh, changes, some blind fixes, change ace. Change hard with uh, club. Well, I will change hard with ace. 
I want the fastest marbles, uh, the four fastest marbles on the, on the arena and Ace as a goalkeeper. Lee, Can we turn this time. around? Well, not really. Not really. That's 2-1. One. 1-3. One, ah, oh, okay. Yes, yes, that was a goal from the Rangers. So, but what difference does it make? And we're rolling. In case you're wondering whether, you know, if, if you see that you're not going to make it to the next round, the one thing that you want to focus on is that you need to lose by the smallest uh, possible margin. Even if this is just for one goal or, you know, you, you can capitalize uh, when you are going to the, to the extra time. I mean, if full time is a draw and you go to the extra time, uh, the, 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 the only thing that you don't want to see is that you are eliminated. But if you do, you'll be happy to see that the other teams have lost um, in the first two halves. So this will mean that um, the the official score that you will get will be a draw, not a loss, if you go to the extra time, which means that you will get higher up the places and get more points. Great this start. didn't happen with us, and there was a team that lost in the extra time, so we lost, so we uh, lost from them for, oh, the for sure. Really appreciated that one. And we got uh, three goals against us, two goals for uh, one goal for us. And the job breakers, three one. Pinwheels. And they progressed the next round. And down through. Not so many marbles this lodge. But what do you know? Two one. The Pacific Pinwheels against Team Momo. They have this upper hand, but it's only one ball, one goal. And Team Momo are getting two, but the Pacific Pinwheels get two as well. Three four. The final result. You see, we're still slightly. Great These teams start. are getting better and better. Oh, the goalkeeper ca caught one ball and one late goal for the Hornets. 2 1. Down they come. And we have a lot of marbles, a lot of opportunities. The goalkeepers are, keep, are saving some much needed bo uh, balls, Great. but. The Lava Rockers, wow! The Lava Rockers, 2-3. What a result, what a match. So next round, the Russell Racers against the Oceanics. This is good for us because only one of them will uh, jump us in the standings. And I hope that the Oceanics will progress in the next round and then get eliminated from either Noxious, Ivy or Rangers. Then we have the third match, uh, the quarterfinal. Thunderbolts and or, uh, straw, not strawberries. Why strawberries? Um, Jawbreakers and the last one is the Pacific Pinwheels against the Lava Rockers. The but first, and the Oceanics. thank you, Greg. Down we are underway. One goal for the for each team, so this will be a draw in the first half. And with no delays, we get to the next not second half. Start from everyone that time. A lot of marbles dislodged. One goal, two goals for the Oceanics. What the Rosberg says can say about this? Nothing. 3 1. I'm fortunate. I'm fortunate because the team that's, that sits lower in the standings progress and they won with a relatively big margin. The Rangers now are in front. So, 1 0. Um. The, the Rangers need to get two goals more while getting zero. Well, never mind me. 2-1 the final result. And the Noxious Ivy will be um, ahead. Yes, they will be ahead of the Raspberry Racers, which is good news for us. The Rangers will compete against the Oceanics in the next round. But now we have the Thunderbolts against the, the, the Jawbreakers. One goal from each side. Two goals. A late goal. And the final result is 3-1 uh, for the first half. Now let's go for the full time. Once more, they're off. Oh, the goalie got one for the uh, Thunderbolts, and this means 1-4. 1-4, the job breakers. Completely ashamed. They're 
they do not want to look behind. They, they do not even rejoin their their coach. They're leaving the stadium. Well, and with good reason. If I was hoping for a semi-final uh, advance, but instead got the the worst result of the quarterfinals, I would be ashamed of myself as well. So, Lava Rockers and the Pacific Penguins, the two fantasy teams of our league. I think this is going to be good for Lava Rockers. Yes, 3-1. 3-1. As we progress to the semi-final, the Oceanics and the Rangers will compete against each other and the other match is the Thunderbolts against the Lava Rockers. But first, the Oceanics against the uh, Rangers. Fun favorite team, Rangers. Uh, they get, oh, they almost got three goals, the Oceanics. And I think this is no goals for the, yeah, no goals for the Rangers. This is not going to go very well for us if the Rangers do not get at least two goals and they get three! They get three! That's it's wow. not a convincing win, but I think they'll take it. What a match! They were on the back foot, two goals behind, and they got three on the second half. And you see the goalkeeper. They got that uh ball on the ball on the very last minute on the side, which means uh and Which means that the Rangers will at least get a medal. Whether they say is gold or silver, it doesn't really matter because it's going to be a very good day for them. Lava Rockers, they have only uh, only one goal difference. Moving on to the second half. And uh, Thunderbolts, they get two goals. That's 2-2. Two, two. Oh, 3-1. Well, yeah. I <laughs> I'm blind. Sorry about that. I thought that the, uh, that the Thunderbolts side was the Lava Rockers, but anyway, 3-1 the final score. Now the Oceanics against the Thunderbolts. That's nil-nil. No goals that time. Now let's see the second half. Once more, they're off. What surprises do we have? Oh, we have two goals and now three for the Oceanics. I think this will be a bronze medal for them. Now it's two goals. Wait. Let's Wait a second. On the replay. Wait a second. We want the free cam. The okay, so we've already got two goals. Oh, you see, this didn't count. Oh, okay. That's 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 why you need the um, the VAR technology. To see whether there's a goal, uh, whether a ball is behind the net, uh, behind the line or not. And this time, they weren't. And you see, this is not because the ball stopped, but because the other ball stopped it. In any case, uh, the Oceanics got the bronze medal. Now we are for the gold medal match. And the Lava Rockers, they get one. The Oceanics get zero so far. No. First half is 1-0 for the Lava Rockers. Great start. And now 1-1. One, one. <laughs> that's that's a very strong result. 1-1. One, one. And down they go. All right. All right. We have a lot of marbles dancing around and we have one goal from each side, I think. 2-2. Two, two. Okay, we're play. going to second extra time for the Still final of Football in Gallus Marbley. What an exciting match. And down through. Oh, yes, we got one goal. For the Rangers. Oh! Oh, yes, I didn't see that. L the Lava Rockers got one more, so this will be extra time three. Down they come. Um. Okay, so there is a goal from uh, one side, from the Rangers, and I think this is it. 4-3. Yes, this is it. Extra time, 3. And the Rangers are your gold medalists. What a match that was. I was, you know, we lost first place in the standings, but I cannot complain too much. We had a very, we had very close, uh, not very close, but very, very um, um, competitive matches. As we take a look. The Oceanics, from third place, they jump up to first. And we lose two places. 
three points behind the Raspberry Racers and going to the last round. I think this is a blessing in disguise. You see. You have made oh, yeah, we have too many messages announced for too long. Okay, let's see what do we have here. Reason for the second by the Sandman drone have shown that CC fans area is disorganized. Some marbles have swapped seats with their neighbors. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. That's uh, reading the CC logo formation. Rumors are that the white that white eye is furious about this and quoted as saying this is an embarrassment on the host team and we expect better from our fans. Well Spitfield's shadow right now. Yeah, why not? Ace isn't as quick as they should be. Unfortunately there are no special treatments. Okay, thank you. Um we're delighted and honored to to, the, to be hosting this season of Yellow's Marble League here at Valenia. To show our gratitude to all the teams taking part, we're giving a choice of gifts. <laughs> you may choose between a cash prize and 500 uh, or 500 or an extra joker. Oh no. Oh no. Don't, uh, don't do that to me. I feel this is this is like a cheat if I take the Joker and I want to take the Joker, oh, I sugar that. Oh gosh. What should I do? You know, I will leave this video right as it is. And tell me what to do. Should I take the money or take the extra Joker? Hello everyone and welcome to Yellow's Marble League. As you see, when you do not answer your emails, this is what you get. Ah, uh, you have left some messages unanswered for too long. This is not acceptable. Please completely clear your inbox of all messages. You will not be able to continue your season until all messages have been answered. All right, uh, this is pretty clear. I understand that. So, um, we were left uh, after event 15 of season 14. Um, and uh, because we were low on money, it seems that someone was very kind. And by someone, I mean Cleocatra, the mascot of uh, Marble League 2021. To give us a, a gift, but not only not only uh, us specifically, but everyone in the um, in the championship fight. Anyway, so uh, we're between to take the money, five hundred cash, or take an extra joker. Well, even though I was about to take all, uh, you know, I, I was about to take the money, but all of you told me to take the extra joker, so. This is what I did. Well, I just did. Anyway, so uh, Hart is struggling for speed right now. As it happens, we have an opportunity to send in the entire team for a speed retreat. This should give everyone as a much needed boost. Well, uh, we will pass on that one because it costs 200. Uh, we have 65, so we will be. Uh, it will be minus 135 uh, before the start of the last event, which is, you know. It's something we cannot do. We will be dis disqualified from the season, so we will pass on that one. And there is one more message left. Ace feels uh, they lack strength and power. They request to get some special one-to-one -one training to help improve their strength. You know, it's it's like the previous one. We don't have that money, so we will skip that. And without any further ado, let's go over to uh, the locker room and see which of the marbles. Wow, you see, Tarnus 92% heart is not the marble to use. Speed 5%, especially, you know, it's it's it's, it's totally wrecked. This marble is totally wrecked. 60% uh, of speed, 93% of endurance, 71 for strength, 8 for motivation, 78 for health, and 28 for tightness. Not too bad. Uh, well, this is marble across, so we need speed because it's a fast track. Uh, we also need, need a bit, a bit strength. It's, it's not a vital. Um, how do we say? It, it's, it's not a vital uh, parameter to take into account because you need, you need strength, of course, to uh, to battle for, uh, with the others to battle for position. But in reality, it's not the, the, the main thing. We need speed and endurance. It's a long, it's a long, uh, it's a long course. It's a long race. So 83 percent of the tiredness diamonds will be out. Spade. 83% of tiredness, as you see, the whole team is totally wrecked. 89% for Ace. If we gave that money that we 
uh, you know, that, that, that the message told us 200 for everyone to get some rest or some speed, it will be better. The, the image of the team would be better, but we don't have that money and fortunately we have the Joker, so I will pick Diamond, not Diamond, sorry, I, I will pick Club, which is the marble with the, uh, with the best stats among the, the other team members. So we start with uh, start event with Joker, so this is vital, this is important. If we, uh, by mistake, if There's we the line, uh, press we the other button, then we wouldn't be able to champion. use the, you see the, track very similar uh, the Joker. We run in Marble 1. Except a couple of sand portions. My two cents on this course is not good. Laps, Especially after uh, what I've seen meters. from Mirage Mountain. Uh, you know, this track is Starting. very good. Uh, you know, I, I, I want to give the example run. So let's see. Club. Yeah. We, see, we did not start from last place because we were not first in the standings. So our main rivals are. Raspberry Racers and the Oceanics. The Limers also got a very, very strong season so far. Uh, but, you know, it's it's the two of them. If we finish ahead of them and get a bunch of points, as you see, we are, we are the only team to use the Joker. We are the only team to do so. But, you know, I will not test your patience. Let's get straight to it. Three, four lights, five lights. And we're rolling to decide a Marble League champion. Exactly, and things uh, are going very good after turn four. Let's see how. Oh yes, that was very good. That was very, very good. Now, we are up. Okay, yeah, we lost a lot of places. The Pacific very, 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 very we lost the another one from the Rangers and Maxi Savi, but we're still in the mix. And ooh, it's it's a very nice battle. It's a very nice battle. A very, very long races of, uh, as well because we're uh, just lap three. Of 22, and we often see overtaking chances in the but The main thing is that the Oceanics and the Raspberry Racers are far behind. Let's let's see what what are they doing? They're fighting with each other. This is good for us. Oh, and they are very very far from uh, uh, you know from the rest of the field. So the Limers are safe. The Raspberry Racers are pretty much knocked out. I will not write them off. Everybody uh, crossing at this the point because it's only uh, lap six lap. for the uh, sorry lap five of 22 uh so anything can happen but you see things are not going good for them they're only standing in last place they are uh you know hitting the, all the goals from side to side but this is not this is not very uh important let's go to the oceanics the oceanics are in penultimate place oh that was a very nice move from the outside at turn three the oceanics only to yeah, Hornets. They start in penultimate uh, place, fourth place for the Oceanics. But we, we have gained so many positions. We're in fourth place, fifth now. Wow! Taking a look at the order, and it's right lap now, eight to twenty-two. Pinwheels, the Bumblebees, the Jawbreakers, and your team. And we gained two places. The wow! Breakers, team you know. Lomo. I would be glad if we win this challenge without the aid of Joker. I mean, <laughs> it's 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 only for the for the show. I, I I would love to win this season, but not with the aid of the Joker because I feel that since we're on the only team that we're using this aid, everyone else opted for the cash and get some training possibly or some special sessions. Uh, it feels like a cheat only to you know for, for us to be the only team to. Uh, complete with uh, double points finish. In any case, you, you see there is something. You, something you, you know, you, you gain something and you lose something. If you get the cash, you have the opportunity to. Oh, that was a very nice move from the outside over to the Oceanics, and they are on our tail. And we hit the wall, but you get the winners of this Everyone battle. Everyone crosses the line once more to start the next uh, lap. We just now, is this started the second half of the race. Or is it simply a lack of fitness? Things are, 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 you know, are very good for us up to this moment. The Oceanics are getting a bunch of points for now, but we get the Joker and this doubles our tally. Let's see how things will unfold for the, for, for the rest of the race. So I was saying that you gain something and you lose something. Uh, if you opt for the cash, then you have the, the opportunity to close all the 
Uh, dark spots of the team right and get them rested team or get Momo. into a spa the session or some speed training and stuff and, and everyone Pacific will get Kings. some uh, good amount of uh, uh, you know of, of improvement of help of uh, increasing the stats uh, essentially or you can use the same cash to get some training and make one marble a superhero of the of the race get everything on 100 or as, oh no this did not help us at all and we are in a very difficult position. Uh, the Oceanics are just behind us and side by side. Wow. We kept them at bay for now. Sorry for screwing your ears. But this is very intense. Jeez. Everybody crossing the line once more to begin the next lap. Lap 17 of 22. We have five laps left. Oh no, and things are not are not going great for us. Things are not looking good for us. We need Only a few we need some kind of a miracle here. The Raspberry Aces are definitely not out. They, they will not today. get the title, but we still have to make some places. And this is not helping us. You know, hitting the, the walls and dancing side by side every time we hit the, the entrance and the exit of the sand uh, section is not helping at all. Ah, that was that was a very nice move. Taking a look at the order right now, the lava rockers, Team Momo, the bumblebees, oh, and Team Momo the are definitely on it. And it comes with no surprise after the recent win in Midnight Bay, with Mimo getting a fantastic win in Marvel One Season Three. But this is lap twenty one of twenty two. We're getting to the end of Marble League 22, Season 14, and the Oceanics lost one place the to the Hornets. But we also lost one place, so... Ah, it's going to be close. No, it's going to be close. Ah, no, we didn't need that. We didn't need that. It's the final lap. And we finished ahead of the Oceanics. Oh, gosh. This was a very close, a very close fight. I'm very curious whether we got, we got them. Um, Team Momo won the race, the Lava Orchers in second, and the Orangers with a stunning race. Again, uh, you know, climbing up the order uh, as, as I did in, uh, uh, in the most recent race in uh, Midnight Bay, Marvel Run Season 3. They were in 13th place, dropped to 18th, and they managed to climb up the order and get 6th place. I mean, 6th place for title contender is not very good, uh, essentially. Oh, let's get to the uh, But you know, As we take a look this at the is final definitely standings. a damage limitation. Oh! Congratulations on being crowned oh, no. Marvel League Champions. You're kidding me! <laughs> we won it! We won it! Gosh, I don't know how to feel right now. I mean, I'm happy. We won the we won the season, and we won it in style. But if it wasn't the, the Joker, if we didn't want, if it, we didn't, uh, you know, choose the Joker to to compete and get se uh, not 17 but 14 points instead of seven, uh, we would lose out to the Oceanics. Oceanics fans, I'm so sorry because. If you're seeing this, uh, maybe you will be disappointed to see losing a Marble League title only because you've got one gold medal less. But, oh my, what a season. Have mail. Congratulations on winning season 14 of Gilda's Marble League. Your management style and dedication to Marble Sports has clearly paid off. Thank you. Oh yeah, and this is some, something else that happens every time you finish uh, the season and you have some leftovers in your uh, uh, balance uh, you will convert them to uh, marble so you can use them to uh, get more stuff within the game or uh, you know uh, generally increase your collection if you have already thousands of marbles so uh, we have already a lot of silver marbles we have very few bronze marbles we ha I think we have only five and uh, we have uh, uh, well over 100 gold marbles, so I will go with 30 bronze marbles. You see, 
this doesn't mean too much. It, it, it's the same amount of money, whether you choose to uh, get gold, silver or uh, bronze uh, marbles. Um, you know, what's, what, what's the loop with that? It only makes a difference when you, uh, when you still have stuff uh, to the uh, to the game to buy, let's say uh, getting some uh, more events or you know unlocking some extra features. But anyway, here we are after event 16, we got uh, we got uh, 14 points instead of seven, and what it went with 186 points, we got the title, the Marvel X22. Not yet. The Marvel X21 season 14. We are champions. The Blackjacks, thank you, thank you so much. And the Oceanics, they uh, missed out uh, only by a margin. I mean, you see, it would be any any event, any event. You can see where you lost all the momentum or you gained. And you see, we got in event 14 only one point. This really hurt our uh, championship fight, especially when our main rivals took uh, 12 points. Uh, the Raspberry Race has got zero points, of course they finished in last place and with a tie we would be very much in trouble, you see three gold medals. But alas, they finished, four, they finished fourth, not only they lost the chance to win the title, but they also lost a podium finish. So the Limers, third place. Who could have thought? And where's Team Momo? Oh no, Team Momo, 14th place even if they won the, the race, it was only their third medal. Uh, no medals for the Hazers and the Bumblebees who, as it seems, they've got to uh, encounter a very difficult season. And um, now, you know, I will, let's, let's be realistic, it was a dismal season for teams like these. The Bumblebees have been exceptional uh, in Hubelino tournament in the past, so someone would argue that they would be doing better, but it seems their form is dropping again and again. We say this in... Uh, We've seen this in Marble X21, uh, the, the YouTube version. Uh, we've seen it here, and we've seen it in Marble One Season Three uh, so far. With one, with one race to go, things are, are uh, you know seem difficult for them. So uh, this is it. This was the very last event of Season 14 in Marble. Let me know down in the comments what your thoughts are, especially after winning the title only because of the Joker. And thank you guys. Thank you everyone for comment uh, for commenting and tell me to choose the Joker. If it wasn't you, I would be second now. Uh, be sure to subscribe to uh, Minus Marvel Orchestra because more videos like this are coming on the way. We are going to uh, we are going to launch a new uh, uh, series called uh, Marvel Rally Fantasy using the 16 mm marbles we have. Uh, the, the teams will be chosen by you. All the fans that commented to my uh, uh, to, 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 to my video, uh, so, sorry, not to my video, but to the post, and um, I, I will I will announce soon, uh, hopefully by the end of the week, which teams uh, are going to participate in this fantasy league of Marvel Rally. Hope you enjoyed this video, and till next time, keep it rolling. <laughs>